G Money, what up, man? What up, though? Talk nice, man. We here. Yeah, I'm chilling. How you doing? You good? What's good? What's up with you, man? You got the mix match shoes on today. What's up? Yeah, what's yeah. Up? Well, nah, I just I just did it for a skit. My Adidas is somewhere over there. Mm -hmm. on the so I'm outside. Yeah, 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 yeah. You Funky know, shits. I'm chilling, man. I'm just. How you feeling? I'm good. Today it's you were DJing today. Yeah, I had, to, I had two events. You know, what I'm saying straight from the club, straight from the from the um. Ch 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 Jones, Jones, we ain't talk, we ain't get to you yet. Please stay quiet till we <laughs> do our introduction. Thank you. Thank you. Please don't do that, Jones. <laughs> don't be ignorant, bro. Smooth nigga, man. Nah, you know what I'm saying? Hype, no hype, no hype, cool, it. man. Nah, <laughs> what I said, enough, off the rip. Oh, yo, yo, I like yo, him. He cool, nah, man. Nigga, please, right? Yo, okay, I'm I ain't sorry. Know he's a DJ. Damn, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it was good tonight in the city. Yeah, yeah the city, city joint. Every Thursday we at ER bar, um, ER bar and lounge. That's you know what I'm dope, saying? Man. Second Avenue, thirty third, thirty fourth Street. That was one. That was that was one of the main goals, man. You in the city now? That's good, man. How you feel? Yeah, you How does it feel in there? We got breakthrough. You know what I'm saying? It's a good vibe in there. It's a good vibe. You know, I get a chance to play. A lot of different music, you know. Instead of like certain clubs, you play like the same same ten song. You know what I mean? They they, they want to hear the the same trap joints all night long. So I, I'm in the city. I got to get to rock out. You know what I'm saying? A little hip hop, R and B, EDM. Mm -hmm. I could play the, the dubstep. I could play a little bit of everything. Spaces, what up, man? How you doing today, man? Shout out to you. Good, you good? Right. Feeling better? You sick the other day? You feeling good? Well, I know. I know he takes sick days. He texts yeah, me like, "Yo, yeah, I can't yeah. make it out tonight, bro." I, yeah. I was like, "What? You I'm sick? Like, sick? You had a cold? You went to the doctor? Or you just Caribbean style?" <laughs> You still got it? Okay, okay. You still got it? I don't want you in here. You spreading sure, I'm about to You know what I'm saying? We got to spray this room with some. We got to spray this light saw with some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got shit. And um, I, was, I saw you put out a video with Dawson, which was dope. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what? Yeah, you working. Uh, first one, the first YouTube. one. YouTube.com slash DJG Money is working. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? That's, a fact. That's dope, man. That's, we got some more videos dope. to come. You know what I'm saying? Just, just the process. The process. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm. <laughs> I'm chilling, man. You know, I see you out here wilding again, man. Nah, nah, we don't talk about everybody, that, everybody asked me like, "Yo, what's up? Why, why you see in the video?" I said, "Nah, he wilding. Oh, I, I ain't messing with Flip, man." They always saying that, man. Why okay. you not in the videos with Flip, man? I said, "Nah, I'm good, bro." When he start wilding, I ain't. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I'm yeah. chilling. Hey, yo, space. Why, why, why the why the volumes look so high, bro? We lit today, man. I know we ain't talking that loud. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Gang, 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 gang. G money. Yo. <clears throat> How you doing? You good? <laughs> Every show. Yo, you, yo, Episode. What? You got niggas stopping me every day like, yo, I saw the shit with the, he, he like the sneakers don't fire. Is this shit real? So like, this shit really real? What's this, nigga? 49? Yeah. What do you mean is it real? They See, ask me that every day. Yo, I see this. It can't this, be this, every this. day. It can't be every day, man. No, they ask, every, I get stopped every day like, yo, you see your man flip wild again. I see him in the store. I see him doing this shit. I seen him, you know, the battle rapper shit. I seen him with... Fat boy, da, da, da. is all these shits real? So I'm like, yeah, nigga, that's why I'm gonna be there, cause nigga be wildin'. Yeah, but you know, we, you know, we, you know, we, we, we gotta definitely work. G Money, yo, episode <laughs> motherfucking forty nine, nigga, nigga, we, we made, made it. it. Woo. Of course, like, a lot of audience in here, you know what I'm saying? Thousand people in the background. Oh, you got the headphones from Taxi. Today, so we got today, <laughs> we got two special guests. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? Let me start from left to right. You know my man Grizzy from Queens, right? Grizzy Hendrix. Yeah, yeah, Grizzy Hendrix. Yeah, yeah. Northside Queens, correct? No, nah, no. Nah, I'm from Loyalton. Loyalton, but you just mm. see you around where, you told I my man Sirius Jones you was around from where I'm from. Oh, for real? No, you didn't. <laughs> I didn't tell you that. You just no, told you said, Sir, he yeah. said what he said, where you from? You said I'm, I'm I'm from where around where he's from. No, I said I'm from Loyalton. I mean, I said I'm from Queens. I didn't say all that shit. You sure? I'm i did I tell you that? He don't remember. Oh. I, I, heard, I heard it too. I heard it too. He said, "Y'all from where?" Yeah, Queens he Clippers pointed from. at me. Y'all yeah, right? from where? And, and, and then he. Well, I mean, hold on, hold on. And then, and then, Maybe and then, he and, Queens. Yeah, that's Maybe what I meant. Oh, okay, okay. I was just saying it. Uh, okay, all right. So you could have said that, nigga. Then you brought Nitty name. Nitty from the north side. Trying to catch niggas. He trying to. Like, hold up, nigga. You just said you was from Wyoming. Like, and then next to him, we got shout out to Jimmy Hendrix. You know, Jimmy Grizzy Hendrix, rapper. Facts. Queens in the fucking building. Queens. Salute to you. Then we got <laughs> my man. Mm -hmm. You know somebody I, you know I knew for a while. You know I mean, good guy to me. Well, yeah. thank you, sir. You know, please don't let me give my introduction. Oh, now I'm joking. joking. <laughs> my man, Serious Jones, man. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's up, Serious? Oh man, you know, Jersey in the building. Oh, you know. You know <laughs> Yeah, turn the mic. Yeah, turn the mic down a little bit. Down. Oh, okay. Pause. Like, but yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Say that. 
Better? All how, right, you cool. how you doing? How you, how you doing? How you doing, Grizzly? I'm chilling. I'm just happy to be here. I know y'all podcast is like, what'd you say the ranking was? Uh, we don't need to talk about that, man. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to yeah. throw you the yeah, What's up? What's up? What's up? You trying to throw me He's the up alley. there. He's up there. <laughs> See, he told me his shit, Grizz. You tried to throw me the alley with my podcast. It don't make sense, my nigga. I don't need the alley. Uh, he was talking. He, he said he, he checked us out. He, he a fan of the show. He said, yeah. you, see the, you know, you know, we up there in the rankings and the, the podcast I mean, rankings. Know, yeah. You know, I mean, that's cool. We, 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 we trying. He wanted you to talk your shit. He yeah. wanted you to. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, but before we get to my man Jones, real quick, you know what I'm saying? Let, let's talk to you real quick. What is the 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 the, the goggles about? And what is the face paint about? So goggles. Facts. Yeah, yeah, they, nah, these is goggles. Just but, goggles, you just yeah, wear yeah, with. just goggles. Like, I mean, I dress real fucking like eclectic, so it's like this is just my style. Like, what's eclectic? Like different. <laughs> like, I like wearing <laughs> I shit see. that fucking got straps on it. I got goggles. It's like I don't like looking like everybody else. And I like doing my own shit while everybody else is. Fucking wearing, I don't know, true religions or whatever. I'm a throw on. True religions been out for a long time. I know. I'm, <laughs> I'm, just, yeah. I'm just speaking yeah. in general. Got like, you, got you. If niggas is wearing that, when I'm they was do doing that, that's when he stopped. <laughs> 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 no more. Yeah. So, so what, 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 what's the definition of the, of the face face paint? Because I see that in a lot of a lot of my shit. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Well, I mean, this actually came from dead presidents. But I started mm. freaking it and just, you know, doing it. So there's no hat. definition. You just dead presence the movie. You was a fan of the movie. Yeah, I was a fan of the movie and I just started throwing it on because I, I was a fan of the movie. You know what I'm saying? And then I did this video called J. Cole Ain't Fucking With Me. Everybody was like, yo, who's this kid? I remember. I saw that one. Yeah. Niggas was like, Well, you came at J. Cole for, though? I mean, it's competition. It's hip hop, bro. Mm. You, you a fan of battle rap, so you know. I'm not like, really a fan of anything. You're not a fan of battle <laughs> no. rap? No. It is his best. All right, so I, you a fan of the hip hop culture? I don't know what I'm. A, I'm a fan of rock and roll, man. But yeah, it's just, <laughs> it's just hip hop, basically. So oh that's why you God. chose to get at J Cole. Yeah, but I mean, it's not like it. Truthfully, that video was not getting that cold. It was actually getting at the 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 fickle fans of hip hop. Cause before the face paint, niggas used to compare me to Cole. Like whenever I was doing shows, they'd be like, "Yo, you you remind me of Cole. You sound like Cole." So I had to do mm -hmm. something to deviate from that shit. What's mm -hmm. your background, ethnic? I'm black and Puerto Rican. Okay. All right. Real quick. Okay. Nigga How long Rican. you been doing the face paint? I mean, I, you know, the face paint shit. What do you call that? I, I don't want to disrespect that and say face painting because that's Niggas, like. No, I mean, I'm trying to hype that nigga. No, I'm that's saying face paint because you talking about face paint. You want to call war paint? I, I don't know. He, he, might, he, might, he, he, he might have a name for it. I'm gonna be doing your war, your war art. He might, he might have a name for that shit. I don't know. Man. I think face paint. I think little kid party. I don't want him to take it out. You know. Oh shit! Did you want to fall? I didn't see. Uh, oh, see, I want, see how you do this? Y'all good? Y'all good? Y'all good? I want to know what he called. That boy good. <laughs> you think I got a name for his face paint? Nah, I want to. Do you have a name for the face paint? He's nah. like, do you do kids' birthdays? I mean, these are things we need to know. You know? Nah, that's <laughs> nah, that's good. Like, nah, already, but, but, but so, so you've been rapping for how many years? I've been rapping since I was like, I, all right, I say like 12 years. How much are you? Yeah, you from Queen. You ever fucked a bitch from the Bronx? <laughs> nah, I don't know. I no, had, I know, no. I'm saying I oh. had. I'm gonna tell you I burnt before. Keep it real. Nah, nah, chill. Don't lie, it's all right. I'm, man. I'm. First of all, I'm too cautious when it comes. Mm. To I'm mm. too cautious. Protection. Like I'll be on. Wrap it up twice. No, you can't I'm talking like about the, fr the friction. Of the that's condom. weird. That's, that's <laughs> weird. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Figure of speech. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> nah, but I just be on it. Like so, I, you never, you never got burnt before. No, never, ever. How old do you? If you don't mind me asking. I can't give away my age, bro. Oh, you don't mm. give away your age? Yeah, I don't give away Why? Nah. Nigga, 47. Especially, I'm in the hip-hop <laughs> culture. You can't even God do damn. that. Are you above 20? God damn, 47. Yeah, yeah, I'm definitely above 20. Are you above 30? All right, you're killing me. Bro. You gotta be. <laughs> you gotta me, be. Yeah, a, yeah. When you say no, I can't tell you. You gotta be at least more than like 25. God damn, 47. All right, I'll tell you that. I'm above, above 25. That's all I'm gonna say. Are you under 30? Come on, <laughs> me, you're killing me. Uh, Yo, I'm above 25. No. Nah, nah, because you say you saw me, nah, and you know, you above 30, you probably 30 something then. How are you, Flip? I'm 30. Oh, okay. I was born 87. Cool. You 30? Yeah. I thought yo, you was I... like 45, man. Goddamn. That's one. You got yeah, two more to get at you, yo. Nah, nah, nah. You gonna get at me anyway. Yeah, yeah. I'm about to sneak my shit in early. I... Yo, I did not know you. Was so you have any children? Any, any family? Any nah, nah, no children. You just want to just rap all day. You fuck any bitches? You got girls? <laughs> I got a girlfriend. You got a girl? How long? How many years? 
Um, I mean, we've been together for a few now, but like it ain't years. It's like we going on a year. Met on MySpace. <laughs> nah, I mean Instagram. Nah. POF. Oh damn. Yo, POF. I don't even is know what that is. Plenty of fish. That shit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that shit is. I don't he know like, why y'all laughing. Like that shit works. That shit is wavy, b. <laughs> I don't know what you're laughing about. That shit is way. <laughs> nigga, you know what you I'm laughing about, nigga? Too? Nah, I don't fuck with Tinder. That okay. shit is corny. You made your I'm girl. I, 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 so how did that come about? So you just on POF because you, you, you felt like. That... Hey, let me tell you, I yeah. met her with the face paint on POF. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. I swear to God. It. And you had to get me. She cool. All right, so yeah. we can get back to you. Yo, Joan, what up, boy? Serious Jones, rapper. Serious, serious, serious. Nigga fucked the deal, fucked up his deal. What up, man? Fucked up my deal. See, funny guy. I guess everybody fucked up the deal then, right? So the whole label got dropped. So everybody fucked their deal up? That's true. Tell us who you are, though. Okay, well, you know, I'm Serious Jones. I'm a orator. I'm a wordsmith. Mm. I'm, a, I'm a player with a very spectacular vernacular, you know what I'm saying? Mm. And you went to I've college, been, man. I'm, yeah, I've been, I actually went to college. I went mm. to jail. I was a barber. I was been a hustler. I just done every neighborhood, you know, thing that you can do. You play ball, too, athlete. huh? Yeah, I played ball, too, you know what I'm saying? I used to, I did every activity you could think of, but I, I kind of found my gift in creating, you know what I'm saying? Making words come to life, making videos right. come to life. So now, you know, um, I battle. Mm. Uh, a lot of people regard me as, you know, one of the goats. You know what I'm saying? I think I'm very, very Billy about that goat conversation, mm -hmm. you know, all puns intended. So mm. um, I got battles going on. I got films coming out now. I got new album, new music, and we got drama, real life shit that's going on. Things I, to I, talk I, about. You moving kind of fast. Let's slow down. Tell no, no, no. That was it. That was, that was summer. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us how it started, though. Serious Jones, where you were born? It where started, were you born? Where um, were you born? I was actually born in Detroit. I was born in Detroit, Michigan. Mm. And how, um, how long you lived out there? I lived out there till I think I was about four or five. Okay. And, um, Both parents, mother and father? Or? Yeah. And my uncle, shout out to my uncle Greg, he was, and my uncle Rip, um, he kind of, they kind of got into some crazy shit, and that's why my family went to Detroit. And then um, we came back, and I lived in East Orange, New Jersey, when I first came to Ill Town. Did you move? And, did you, Did you come back with both parents? Yeah, my parents were together. They've divorced, you know, when I was later in life, but they was together when I was a kid. But oh, they was together when you was yeah. a kid. Okay, yeah. both both parents. All right. So, yeah. how was it living in your home? Oh your man, it was did? it was it was it was beautiful at first. You know what I'm saying? My my mom's a school teacher. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Um, my pops was a a hustler, a worker. You know, he he had always had like two or three jobs, two or three hustles. Mm -hmm. He's the one that actually taught me how to hustle. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So when I was young, we used to do a lot of activities. You know, shout out to my two little brothers, my older sister. You know, we was a close knit family. We was Afrocentric. We mm -hmm. would you know go to uh, Harlem Week and you know all the different neighborhood festivities of the unit. So I was raised with that real family, you know, that black family thing, you know what I'm mm -hmm, saying? Mm -hmm. And um how was it going to school in Jersey? How how was it like going to school? What type of kid were you? Um I tried to be a nerd, but it wouldn't work cuz <laughs> my hood you had to fight. So if you were smart, you have to fight for being smart. Mm. And it would be like I East tried Orange. East Orange. No, I was East Orange when I was a kid and then I um when I was about, I guess, seven, six, was eight, whatever, I went to Inglewood. That's where I'm from, 4th Ward, Inglewood, New Jersey, Lafayette Avenue. Mm. When I first moved to Inglewood, I was in Rock Creek Terrace. In Inglewood, we have like little, um, like two story, one story communities. That's like our projects. Rock View, I mean, excuse me, Rock Creek, Park View, Westmore, King Gardens. So when I first came there, um, Inglewood was a lot rougher back then too, because that was like before the gentrification that's going on everywhere, really. Mm -hmm. And that was like you know the early '90s, so you know what I mean. I, you had to fight. So mm -hmm. I had I had a big mouth since I was a little kid, and everybody knew my family. So you know I always was that kind of guy. You know I always had to back my mouth up. So that's you know kind of how I got into battle rap because. Um, when I was about 16, 17, I, I started smoking weed. <laughs> and uh, I got into like dares where, where you start freestyling, clowning. But it started as snapping, because you know, I was like one of the snap guards in my hood. I named a lot of people that they name is still some snap from mm -hmm. 10 years ago. And like, it got to a point where I just started being like a voice for the hood. And like, niggas want to see me go against people. So I got into a battle. 
I came in like second place out of like 50 people and I got some money. And that was the first you time. Come I, up, you got in a battle at 16? At 17. That was 17, my first, yeah. b- first battle. It was like a tournament back then. It was like 50 people. Where, and, in Jersey? Uh, no, this was in Florida when I went to school. I went so to school in you Florida. You skipped the whole shit, nigga. Why you went to school in Florida? Well, I ain't skip it. You ain't asked that yet. You just said, when did it start? I right, told you when uh, it started. Why you went to school in Florida? You in um, trouble? Nah, I went to college. I went to about college. college. You graduated yeah. early. I graduated. Yeah, I was like young for my grade. Like you know, what I'm saying mm-hmm. I was always younger than everybody. Um, even now, like a lot of my friends, they 40. Like you so, know when you mean? was right, when you when you were writing, were you writing before? You- I wasn't writing at first. At first, this shit would just come to me and I'd say it, and that's why my shit was so crazy because they like, there's no way you could think of this. Did you battle in uh, high school? A couple times for fun, just in the cafeteria type shit, but it wasn't like a real thing to me. I never wanted to be a rapper. So what you trying to do in high school? Like, what, I was what, ball. What was your... I was trying to play ball. I thought I was going to the league. Mm. I, if I had my mind made up, that was it. You played had, on a school team or you played? Yeah, I had school? I had letters, schools, all that. But um, in my junior year, I actually got surgery on my knee. I got in a car accident mm. and I tore my knee up, so I couldn't play that year. When I came back the next year, I played, but I wasn't really getting the you know. The, the light like I wanted because I'm 6'4". I was always this tall even then and I was a guard and um oh man I hate yo my coach is like this nigga was the biggest hater ever like hmm. because my uncle was actually his best friend and my uncle was like a, a all you know all American rest in peace my other uncle Billy actually died in like a real tragic thing and shit like you know but he was actually they was both all Americans and mm-hmm. my coach played with them so my uncle always just made it a point to like remind this nigga how I'm better than his nephew that plays on the team. You know what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. he would just make this nigga hate me. You know what I'm saying? So and I can't lie, one time he got crossed in the park. <laughs> he used to play in the park in the summer. One time he got crossed and he fell right at my feet. I ain't gonna lie, I bust out laughing. I know he remembered that moment for the rest of my high school career. Who so crossed him? I don't even remember. It's just you know you just see an old you know old nigga get crossed. And he falls. He's right here, and I just look down. And I just bust out laughing. So I know he hated me. He hated me. He actually hid my college letters. He did a bunch of fuck oh, shit. Wow. But crazy. I wound up going to uh, Florida and them. You talking about your, um, your coach did this? Yeah, my coach actually hid. High school coach. I I caught because you know how when you go into disciplinaries, he was just some excuse my language the disciplinarian. Also, but mm-hmm. you know how teachers' offices and shit, they got those little metal racks that sit on top mm-hmm. of each other. And I'm just sitting in his office one day, and I see like the end of my last name kind of, it looks like sticking out from one of the letters, but it's like underneath my shit. And I'm looking like, hold up. And he walked out the room, I kind of pulled it out. It was a stack of like 16 letters. And he just never told me he came. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, so when he came back, I was like, yo, you wasn't gonna, oh yeah, yeah, I, you know, yeah, that came. I was like, wow, this nigga yeah, really, to wow. this day, like, I really can't understand how a grown man could do that to, like, a 16-year-old kid. Like, you don't want to see a nigga make it that bad? But whatever. I think, you know, I probably had a big mouth and an attitude then. So, you know, he, he probably just, you know, he didn't want to see me win. But I went to school in uh, Florida and them, and um, honestly, I just, I didn't love it as much as I thought I would at that point. Because once you get to college, mm-hmm. basketball is like a real job. You know what I mean? It's right, five right. in the morning, you running five miles. You know what I'm saying? Like, we don't care if you're just starting to get pussy, you just smoke some weed, and you want to sleep to, like, no, five five miles running. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And these niggas was big, country-fed, you know, in shape. I'm coming from the city just thinking because I got game, I got I cross you. I can. That Once you get to that next level, it's serious. You know what I mean? So, so th- that's when I discovered the music, though. All right, so, so uh, Mr. Grizzy, you ever you ever saw the show before? You ever? You saw oh yeah, I've seen his battles. So you yeah. watch battle rap? Definitely, definitely. How long you been watching it for? I mean, I'm not gonna sit here and say like I was like on it from the nah. I'm lying because I used to watch it on them Smack days. Mm-hmm. And you stopped Smack DVD. Yeah, I did. I just stopped getting into it. Yeah. So Smack. So when when music started for you? The music started for me when I was fucking eleven. My cousin, he was he was into it, so I fucked with it, and you know I I like what he was doing. I actually I wanted to be like him. That's what it was. So he was rapping. I was like, fuck it, I want to rap. I be forgetting shit too. Honestly, actually, music started before rap. 
because I played the drums when I was younger. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I played <laughs> instruments. I'm just a creative <laughs> nigga with that need to do something with his brain well, all the funny. time. He played drums? So nah, he, he like, you didn't do anything out this motherfucker. Uh, yeah. But yeah, so I used to play the drums. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I used to play music. So, But I never thought about, I didn't want to be a rapper. I wasn't, you know what I mean? Because mm-hmm. to me, and even in that era, Rap was starting to be like, you know, it's the niggas talking about what we do. These niggas ain't real, like, you know right, what I mean? Right. So I didn't even really want to be a rapper. I was in denial for years, like, and niggas had to tell me, like, bro, you're bugging. Like, you're really a rapper. Like, just let it go. So niggas made right. you made you feel like it, made made you feel like it was nice. Of course, that's that's what does it to you as an MC when you see people react to how you with the shit you do. You know what I'm saying? When you see it affects people, and you like, oh shit, it's a real thing. Mm. Uh, what what school you went to? Um, I went to fucking. I actually went to a fucking Catholic school. It was in Manhattan. Sweet. But I'm not gonna say the name because I got the face paint, bro. There's certain things I just can't say. I mean, <laughs> so you don't like, want people like, to exactly. know exactly. Like I'm trying to keep a whole okay. mystique about me, so it's like mystery. There's man. just certain things I can't <laughs> reveal to people. Oh, and man. tell me, and tell me what's your reason for doing that. Well, because of the things I, uh, I feel personally, I talk about a lot of deep shit in my music. I don't know if you got the chance to take a listen to mm-hmm. it, but I dropped a, a album called America. I feel like I talk a, about a lot of deep, deep shit. So you, think it, so you think that the government... No, no, I'm not one of those dudes. Don't uh, put me in that category, fam. It's, it's, <laughs> it's only two things, two reasons. There's only three reasons that I can see. Number one, you you, you, you had a rough childhood. You probably got picked on, robbed and shit. You don't want niggas to know. Nah, that's, 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 <laughs> yeah. you know? nah, you probably, rob, you probably <laughs> robbed somebody in high school. Oh, I'm, I'm about to get to that. Yeah. Or, you, <laughs> or you, was a, you was a criminal. You, said, rob saying? you probably shit. robbed, violated niggas. Or, you know what I'm saying? The mystique is that. So you're basically saying, that, okay, so what you're telling me now, say, a lot of niggas watch Flip the Script. So right, now, right, right. when they see you saying that and they're going to write in the comments, somebody know you're going to write who you are. What you going to say then? They won't, though. There's nobody. Nobody. So I guarantee you, you no. Know, you that no, not recognizable? I'm, I'm, saying, <laughs> I'm saying, I'm saying that of course, there's going to be people who, like, know Stick me, know me. Wow, they're going to wow, say, like, nice. oh, I know who he is. But I'm saying, no. Nobody's going to write in your comments. How you doing? Yo, I, you know, I you, put money I'm gonna on it, bro. bro. Oh, I man. put money on it. Nobody you. knows. If you, if you tune in right now and you know this man, I want you to write his full government. They're going to write his whole government right on YouTube. Don't gas him. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. They will research Leave it. Let them do it. Let them do it. Niggas like that. We, you, you need niggas to talk like that. Yeah, right. See, I'm saying they gonna be like, he lived it such and, and such and such. And the, I know his mom. The fans that, that fuck with me, they wouldn't do that. Mm. The but fans, the fans that, that fuck with the show. Fan. We talking about, we talking about, we talking about niggas that knew you from before, from prior. You say you don't want oh, to. You talk about, I just told you though, niggas that fuck with you. You went to school in Manhattan. You don't want to say what school because Man. you're trying to have. Bro, I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna, I don't want to be acting like I'm giving you game with that. But I'm gonna just say, don't when you want to keep the mystique. Don't tell them you want to keep the mystique. Well, I you mean, know what I'm saying? It's, 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 that takes away from the mystique. To me, to me yeah. I feel like it's pretty. You know I mean? it's, nah, I feel what you said. You saying. just say some other answer. Like, like you know yo, what? Yo, Joe, the universe does not deserve me. <laughs> 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 then you look like this. <laughs> but I'm, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, they be like, yo, this thing is crazy right here. I'm down with this shit right now. You know what I mean? My problem is I can't bring myself to do that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? See, but the thing about it is, like, I'm one of those dudes, I don't like putting on that. Act as far as that type of shit, like, like you put on that now. You got faith. What you that's talking not, about? That's man. not. A, that's not. Oh. A, man. <laughs> How's that? A, wait. Flip, flip, flip. <laughs> you got a face paint on. Flip, how's that an act, though? You wasn't born with face paint? That's not your true self. How's that an yeah, act, yeah. though, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop, man. Nah, Grizzly, come on, like I ain't even chopping no gas up, but that shit reminded flip. me of what Shiggy, what Shiggy said. <laughs> How? How I'm a clown. How I'm a clown. This nigga crazy. How? <laughs> Gee, nah, tell me. What was, you have face paint on. But how's that an act, though? Well, that is a form of an act. It's, it's a part of your character. Oh, that shit's shit, it's, it's, a, it's a part of your character. Let's go to it's Google. Party, let's go to Google. You know what I mean? See, but that... See, it's, it's yo, like, I, I, I ain't gonna lie to you. If you go to Google and look up the definition of act, it probably says, like... A character that one is portraying as uh, uh, uh. so all I'm saying is, and this is what a lot of fans Not, feel like mm-hmm. they might know all that. Yeah, yeah. yeah they yeah, know yeah. when you see you got a mess on that they don't. You don't want niggas to know something, or you or you want niggas to know something. You know what Facts. I'm saying? Yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah. don't tell them. Let it. Let now, it yeah, do your well, thing. What you I mean, that? he asked though. So I'm I think what you gonna say? What you gonna say? So the face paint is not an act. 
It's you. No, it's definitely not an act. I just told you how how it started. If mm-hmm. I was a fan of death, like this is how it would be an act. If I premeditated everything, like, oh, you know what? I'm a fucking wear face paint to get niggas to be like, yo, what's? Nah, that's not how it happened. It happened because I honestly, truly was a fan of the movie Dead Presidents. <laughs> yo, you weird, my nigga. I, I, I mean, I am. Yo, yo, I fuck with you, I, but that's crazy. I am. So, so I that's am that's premeditation. So you wear this? You, you watch? You wear this? How, how uh, is that premeditation? You watch Dead President? Right? Yeah, okay. Right? Okay. And then before you put the face paint on, you plan to follow what they did. What is that called? That's not premeditated. Premeditated <laughs> would be like, my nigga, I'm premeditated this, would man. be like this. this if, if the whole, <laughs> if, if before this rap. I love this interview. If, this is hilarious. <laughs> nah, but that's not premeditated. Now I see why you, and, and let me say something. That's not premeditated. With all due respect, now I see why you was concerned and you text like you don't want niggas to, uh, yeah. could you text me? You know me. I was I was curious how you got my number, yeah. and I still don't know how you got my number, man. I, 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 I told you. I, nah, nah, nah. My son, my son, my son told me with the day we went to the. Yo. My son told me the day yo. we went to the library. Yo, yo you were ill nigga because nah, he on your wait, show. Wait, you don't know how he got you. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. <laughs> my son, my son told me the day we went to the library. There was a guy that stopped me I and talked to me. Told to me on Jamaica <laughs> Avenue. That's what my son told me. The day we, okay. the day I came to the library, oh, I'm, yeah. I'm like, I don't be on the app. So how the fuck he got my number on the Avenue? So somebody gave my number out of <laughs> one of the niggas that know me in this thing, and, 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 and I was asking nigga, how you got my yo, number? This is flip shit, man. I'm gonna look out for you. Hit oh, that the nigga, he ain't gonna care. <laughs> All right, <laughs> just show him the face paint yo, picture. You gotta take this off, my nigga. You gotta take the label off. You want they, they, they get at oh, you? Oh my bad, bro. They get at me. Yeah, take, take the label off. You drinking it? So he got my number. So I'm like, man, I'm like, oh, this nigga is crazy, <laughs> right? But he cool. He's you like that's sister. good. Bring he, it on. He, he, was, crazy. he was respectful, but I, I still, I'm, I'm a I'm a principal nigga. I'm a principal nigga. That's my thing. I'm a. I'm not about money or nothing, my nigga. I said we just talking about it started with the Instagram post. You know, he's very. Invest into his craft, and I respect that. No, nigga, how you got my number? My niggas, I give him my number. They playing. That's what, so he spoke. <laughs> but after we, we 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 worked out every everything, he was concerned about people making fun of him or me making fun of him on the show. But no, nah, no, nah, that's not that's not it. So say, I, I, say what I, you say. I'm gonna I read said, it. I said I, it's not about making fun because I know people are always gonna joke me for this, and mm-hmm. I and I'm totally okay with that. I know niggas are gonna see this and be like, oh, you look like a fucking clown. I said I don't want you to just make light of my music. My music is the most important thing to me. Mm. That's all I got. Mm. So mm. I, I don't care if you joke my no, face. But this you say, no, but no, I, no, I, I, I hear that wait, all the time. Wait, 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 wait. You said that I know you be joking on niggas and shit, yeah. which is cool. Exactly. Because I expect cool. that, but all I'm asking is y'all don't make me look like I'm just some gimmicky, slim, Jesus-type rapper. Thank you. Because I do take this music shit serious, See, right? See, that, that mm. all falls right? into the category right, Hold on now. Now, you wrote that, and yeah. I respect it. Right, I didn't right. plan on making a joke. But now, when you come in here with this type of talk, it's kind of confusing. What you, 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 You're feeding me something to get at you about. If you understand what I'm saying. I don't like, you're saying, oh, uh, I'm high. I went to school. I'm from Queens. Listen, listen. Now, hold on. Don't cut me off. <laughs> nigga said I'm from Queens. <laughs> then he said that he told a nigga serious that, I'm from where Flip from. Then he say, I say, I'm from North South, I'm from the Farmers, right? So then I said, but you from Lawrence, how you from where I'm from? That's two. Then the nigga, <laughs> then, then. I'm speaking in general, man. Then the nigga, then the nigga, okay. Serious corrected that, I respect that. Then the nigga said that he I'm went to school in Mass, like, Massapequa, look, whatever, right? <laughs> Massachusetts. Massapequa. We went to school, Mass. Nah, I said. Manhattan. 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 See, <laughs> then you go. You're not listening to nah, I don't need this thing. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm just paying. Then he said that his face paint isn't an act. It's not, though. It's not, though. How long have you been doing that? O- o- organically. How long have you been doing that? You watch the, the movie, the you put it yeah. on, nigga. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> how long? How, 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 how long you been doing a face paint? How long? Hello, hello. Please tell me, is that not organic? How long, no. you, how long you been doing a face paint? How long <laughs> you been doing a face paint? How that's long? That's not organic. How long have you been doing it? It's not really uh, organic. How is that not organic? organic? How long have you been doing a face paint? Organic is like something that just happens. That it's just not, happened. No, you, from the movie. You, thought, you saw something, you liked it, and you did it. Poor That's not just jokes. happened. You chose to do exactly. it. Exactly. <laughs> Hold on. So, like, you, organic is like you fell in some paint and that shit said on your mic, face. Your mic, and then motherfuckers y'all, like, y'all, yo, that shit look hot. And you like, that's what I'm doing from now on. Fam, that's I, organic. I feel where you, you know coming from, but I feel like y'all, t- y'all taking that word a little too literal. When I say, like, 
A nigga seen the movie. I like their presidents. I what? said, I'm going to throw on face paint. How long have you been, how long have you been doing that? You, what you how said is you didn't have an ulterior motive. You said you didn't have an ulterior motive. That's different. I should have phrased it like that then. Because the I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, like, I don't this. even know what that. How long? That's how long have you had me. Been, been doing I've been doing it for <laughs> probably my first video. J Cole ain't fucking with me. That was and, the first and, video. And when was that? That was damn. I, that that might have been last year. Nah, nah, nah. Okay. That might have been two thousand. I, I can't lie. I got. I gotta look it up. All right. Really I'm not gonna lie. It that, actually looks kind of like. Nah, it's dope. But that that president. You did it yourself. That president. Fucked up. That president. He's 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 he's, 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 tw he's 25 plus. That president came out in 95. So, when did you see the movie to make you? Because it, it came a long time ago. I know. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I hear what you're saying. My man, ask your question, my nigga. Come on, don't do that. Where is this question, my nigga? What is your question? So I'm trying to figure out when you're did you start. You're not listening. When did the paint start? When did the paint start? Because it came out in 95. So you probably saw it a couple times before you started the face paint. You probably watched it, watched it, watched it, watched it. And you're like, yo, I'm, I'm an artist. You know, da, da, da. He's like, oh, AKA shit. AKA premeditation, nigga. All right, if you want to get specific like that, then okay. I guess I, I, I'll you. agree with you. I agree with you. That, that, that's right. true. But see, the only reason I kept saying it was all organic so wild, was boy. because when, it, when, like, when I did the video, mm -hmm. it's not like three years ago, I was like, yo, I'm going to make a J. Cole ain't fucking with me video and I'm going to okay, throw okay. face paint on. Mm -hmm. It just was like, yo, I'm doing this video. Yo, I always loved the movie Dead Presidents. Let me throw the face paint on. So you threw it on, and then from there, people was... Yeah, pe from there, people was like, who's this dude? So you... How long you been... You see, you been rapping since you was 11? Yeah, yeah. So they liked it and they stuck with it. Yeah, yeah, they liked it and I stuck with it. They liked it and they stuck with it. Well, okay, okay. my fans liked it. I know right. a, lot, a lot of the... I'm not gonna say all the street niggas, cause there are a few street niggas who be in my DMs like, yo, I fuck with you, fuck what everybody else is talking. Mm. Now, there are a lot of street niggas who don't, you know, they clown right, me all right. the time, and that's cool. But at the end of the day, don't get it fucked up. Like, I'm just some face paint nigga and I'm scared. Mm. Like, mm -hmm. I, I, I'm I, a man at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. Nobody's gonna disrespect me. I could take jokes, cause everybody jokes niggas. Mm -hmm. So I'm cool with that, but nobody's going to be like, yo, you pussy. That's not going to happen. Mm -hmm. I'm going to let that be known. Mm -hmm. That's what I was saying as far as re respect and disrespect goes. Mm -hmm. I know y'all niggas is going to joke me. Y'all going <laughs> to joke me all the time like, oh, you look like a fucking clown. Cool. I'm cool with that. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm totally cool with that. Why would we call you pussy out of nowhere? That, I think you, you got look like niggas an like that on warrior. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> why would we just call you? I'm just saying, like you're niggas, supposed to be in niggas do, with wolves niggas do with that, that on right. the internet every day, bro. Every day I hear that. But why would you think that we Who, would do that? No, I, I wasn't saying you. I was just saying, like, as far as my music goes, I just want respect as far as, like, yo, oh, let man. me give him a chance to see what his music is about. I'm not going to just automatically say, yo, you a gimmicky ass rapper. Boom, that's it. What's a gimmick rapper mean? What is, what's a gimmick? Nah, because like, he had the face paint, so people probably think like, he's trying to use that to get he's trying to his say way that, in the you game. Know, it's, you know, you know there's MF Dooms, there's different artists that they have their own thing, but that's not, they still respect their music. He's trying to say he wants mm -hmm. to be respected for his music, even though that's his thing. Yeah, it's just, it's right. just something I, I like to fucking do. It's not... So you feel like even though you dress crazy, yeah, you got the paint. You you don't, you you still a man at the end of the day, that's and people should respect you. <laughs> you you, said you feel like <laughs> that's <laughs> a fact. No, you are the man. <laughs> you are a man. You are a man. Now I'm like not trying to play. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I just I just want to make sure. I got you. I got you. You got a tattoo? This nigga funny as hell. <laughs> man, tattoos, bro. Oh, Super Bowl, man. man. <laughs> so you, nah, I'm just saying he's, he's crazy. I can't. I'm gonna get a heart attack. Fucking Yo, with that serious nigga. business three is a. Yeah, my nigga, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna get a heart attack talking to these niggas, man. How long take you to do that, man? How long take you to do that? Every, every time you got it, um, it take you a long time to do nah, that. Nah, this should take like probably like thirty. No, no, twenty five minutes or something like that. Mm. It's not. It's nothing crazy. This nigga bugged out. You leave that nigga alone, man. What you doing for Halloween? <laughs> I, pro I, probably, I probably with it. With that. I probably will that's with it. That's lit. This. That's lit. Let's go, man. Boy, it's my stuff. Talk to him nice out here. Little, you know what I'm saying? Back to my man, serious. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Back to you, Grizzly. Give, give us a second. Serious. Grizzly so, Hendrix. so let's, let's bring us, bring us to. So you battled a tournament, in Florida. Do you remember the name of the tournament? Nah, back then it wasn't even. It was. It was a spot called the Cow House. I remember it was at. Mm -hmm. It was at the spot called the Cow House, and actually, um. 
that's where I met and became, you know, partners with my dude. Um, at the time, his name was Eclipse. Um, now he goes by Honest English. Mm -hmm. He got um, a bunch of videos out, killed Sway a few times. But, you know, this guy was just, honestly, he was my, one of my main inspirations and in like, oh, no, nah, I got to step my bars up. So we had a group um, called First Ave. Mm -hmm. And um, we kind of really just took the streets on like a, by storm. Um, Lazy K, shout out to her. She was like the first one to really put us on mixtapes. I remember we used to go buy instrumental CDs, J Arms and all mm. that. You remember that? Mm -hmm. You know, from the Africans Arms. on the blanket. And we go, and um, one day I go there. <laughs> and, the and, yeah, that's my memory. Real boy. shit. And, that's um, and I go one day and I see we got all our tracks on the mixtape. And that was, that's honestly was like my first real you know, like, oh shit, this shit is real. Hmm. So back then, honestly, we used to go block to block with a boom box, a bag of CDs, and we was in Trenton, Patterson, Nook, Harlem, Bronx, you know, wherever we could see 20, 30 niggas on a block somewhere, we're stopping, and we gonna make you niggas listen to us rap. If somebody around here raps, you have to bring them out here, we gonna battle them. And by the time we finish, y'all going to fuck with us and buy a couple CDs. And that's so, how so I you started. Were, so you were in the tournament, you came second place. Yeah. All right, what was next? Good. Was next, actually, that night I met Needles. Um, this dude that was a real smart dude at my school mm -hmm. um, was fucking with this, you know, producer that was actually a DJ at the time. Mm -hmm. His name is Needles. Shout out to Needles. He's now multi-platinum. He got all kinds of 50 Bruno Mars Mary J. Blige, all kinds of shit, but um, he actually made the Lil Wayne I'm going in beat, a bunch of shit. Mm. So the first beat I ever rapped on was that night, and it was one of his beats, because after he seen me battling, so I kind of really got pushed into it. Like, the first time I rapped on stage, the, I was in the studio that same night, or the mm. next day, whatever it was, and I was making music, so it was just boom. So it was like, all right, fuck it, I'm here now. So. All right, so now you did that. Now, what came first, the uh, Bahamas battle or the Fight Club? When you started Fight Club came first. Fight Club came first. When you started, how you got into Fight Club? Who got you in there? Honestly, I heard about Fight Club from a couple different people. Was like, that the first league that you joined? That was the first professional battle league that I battled in consistently. Got it. Yeah. All right. So tell us how it happened. Um, basically, I heard, I had already, like, I was at a stage where, like, I wasn't trying to battle for free. And I seen everybody else back then was battling for free. Smack DVDs, all them niggas, they was just battling for the hood. You know what I'm saying? A couple people's a bet every now and then. But I had got into battle rap making money. Like, I really saw, and I always been, you know, I talk for my money. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's how I always been. So I looked at it like, man, I just spent 15 minutes. I didn't fucking prepare nothing. I just got $500 for 15 minutes. Mm. I like this hustle. So like I started trying to bet on myself, but that shit is weird when you in other niggas' hood, they gonna just try to lie, say they man one now, what we gotta shoot it out for you or some weird shit. So I needed a place that I could go that was like a sanctioned place where like it's neutral niggas, it's industry niggas, it's street niggas, but it still got that vibe, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I heard about Fight Club. And um shout out to my nigga Sam Scarfo, first nigga I ever seen me, you know, make ten bands in a battle. He was battling forty cal. And um, he was, come on, farting on the show. Shout out to Chin, It's crazy. It's crazy. Sorry. But anyway, spray some air first. Are you dumb as a chin? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyway. Yeah. So um, this nigga, uh, Sam Scarfo, oh, was with God. Benny Boom. And um, I seen him win 10 bands. And honestly, I was just, uh, you know, kind of wavy. And just I just basically felt so like, fuck that. I'm stealing the shine in here. And I drunkenly just started spitting out of nowhere when everybody was stopped battling and it was just a whole crowd of people just standing there. Yeah. I just stood up and started spitting. And niggas was kind of like, yo, who the fuck is this nigga? <laughs> like, yo, bro, you can't do that. Like, what you doing? And I was like, yo, man, like, what's up? Well, then give me somebody. So I was really just on some bullshit like that. And, um... And bam, yeah, and then that next thing I know, I'm 12 and 0 in Fight Club, and mm. um, after that, that's when all everything came. MTV was there, BET well, was on, there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So you battled Math in Fight Club? Yeah. You said you said you, said you battled. Yeah, him in I Fight killed Club. him in Fight Club. Mm. That's See, why he got really emotionally, groupily right, attached. Let's let, 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 let's 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 talk about this. Well, okay. Anybody who know you, or come across you. Say that, you know, you act funny. 
Now, what? Now, meaning anybody that knows me says some I people. Act funny. Not, yeah, yeah, yeah. No many people say you're a funny <laughs> guy. Is it true? What kind of statement is that? Is it true? What, what, nah, that's not true at all. Flip, what, what are you talking about? I heard numerous people say you act funny. So because you heard numerous people say all right, that yeah, means exactly. anybody that knows not, me right, thinks right, I'm funny? All right, just <laughs> corny. You being corny. I don't I'm mean, being corny. Well, you just made a statement. All right, all right. All right. So I, if you want me to say take back anybody, I'll take it back. I don't want you to take back anything. All right, so let me talk. Let me talk. Feel, let me talk. Say what you feel. I don't feel you act funny. Okay. All right. You but, said anybody that knows me. Go, go ahead. All right, <laughs> but I'll take anybody back. Numerous okay. people that saw you, numerous people that I came across that know you, numerous. And this is a say, old that saying. That know me how? I mean, they met you, not know you. Okay, met okay. you. Okay, all right. There's an old saying growing up that if five people say, different people say something about a person. When there's like smoke, me. it must be fire. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So they say, when they, when they say you act funny, meaning that you just, not not really like. I'm hot. a cocky? Cocky. There you go. That's funny. That's I'm funny. a battle rapper. These are people okay, that don't on, know me on. in real life. All right, cool. So you, 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 so you admit that you have? I up... definitely have a very cocky demeanor. Okay, so Mav said times. that. Mav said that numerous times. You heard the story, right? Is that true? It's not. Fun. <laughs> what are you laughing for? Because this is a man talking about another man acting cocky to him that beat him in a battle rap. And he wants but to be on, friends with him. No, no, mm. but wait, hold on. <laughs> did you act funny to him before? If you of did, course. you did. Oh, so, okay. Why do I want to be your friend, bro? I just killed you in a battle. I don't know you. And you're acting overly friendly to me like you really want to be my friend. I don't know you, bro. Mm. That, that, that's... I don't want to do songs with you. I don't want to hang out with you. At the time, he was nowhere near lit. Mm. And then he took my whole style and started rapping like me. What Iron Solomon said in his battle was true. You used to rap like Bone Thugs but wasn't getting no love. So now you try to rhyme like Sirius Jones does. Mm. This whole swag with the nose grab, all that. He didn't rap like that, bro. I so, killed him in Fight Club with the slow flow. You, ah, uh, ah. Uh. That's, you know what I mean? And after that, he adapted the whole thing. He really wanted to be around me and soak the ism. Mm. But my nigga, you're not going to come soak free game for me. I don't know you like that, bro. Time out, time out. Mm. And that's what happened. I like him, man. He cool, man. He it's talking just true, talk, though. Man. I'm not even trying to be cool. It's hold just, hold on, hold on, he hold on, said it on here. He said I was being cocky because I wouldn't it? fuck with him, basically, right? Why, why, why you got to go on? Right. Slow down. Slow down, George. You're right. You're right. No but, features. All right. So when, before you battled him, you didn't know anything about him. You never no, heard of him. never heard of him at all. So what made them set the battle up? Because at that time, it was really just like, yo, we got this guy for you. We got this guy for you. We got this guy for you. I didn't know probably 90% of the people I battled in Fight Club. Okay, so you, you, remember, know back so you remember battling. You you won. Of they course. said you won. Did of he course. win any rounds at all? Can you give him a round? Or two? I don't think so, no. Mm. Honestly. How many and, rounds and was it? Do you remember? Three rounds. There's always been three rounds. And you never, you don't remember, you, you, came, and get, you came and said, yo, you know what? Honestly, what? at that time, um, I think Styles P was at that battle, actually. Mm -hmm. I think Styles P was at that battle. I remember I had a big, baggy, gray hoodie on. Mm -hmm. And I remember, I think he said one line that was cool. I don't even remember the line. Mm -hmm. But it was like, it was like something, you pussy. It was a pussy line. He just kept pussy and then pussy. So it's ironic. But um, nah, he got killed that battle, bro. All right, so you beat it. And then after, you saying that he tried, he tried, did he try to speak to you after? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just keep it funky. Uh, this yeah. is what happened. Right. After the battle, I try to be cordial with people sometimes, you know what okay, I'm saying? Okay. Because, all right, you a rapper, I'm a rapper, cool, whatever. Mm -hmm. Sometimes, you know, I might say, you know, don't let me get your contact, bro. I gave him my number, right? Mm -hmm. I gave him my number. He started hitting me in, like, the, the way he, You know how... I don't know, man. I'm a certain type of guy. All my guys are certain type of guys. You know the type of people that I hang around. And all of my friends are mostly real certified people that come from urban areas and are now successful. We talk and act like men. We don't do certain things because it comes off weird. Mm -hmm. Maybe even gay a little bit. Mm. So if you say certain things to a grown <laughs> man you don't know, you know, that's, like, overly inviting and friendly, it gets weird to me. I don't know how other niggas move. So he told me he set up a session and um, and was like, yo, I already set up the session and paid for it so we could do this song. Okay. Never said I was going to do a song with you, bro. Hmm. So I just didn't even respond to the text because now I see how you are. You one of those niggas, you expect people to just be cool with you when my nigga, we, got, we ain't established nothing yet. It's different if we smoked the blunt, chopped it up, you know what I mean? That's what I call funny. 
So when people say you acted funny, mm-hmm. if I don't know you, I don't fuck with you, I have no reason to. If they no mutual re- nigga that I respect, connect the dots or none of that, my nigga, I don't, you're acting funny because you expect me to just fuck with you because you want to fuck with me. So he, so after he wrote that, you never responded. So when did he approach you and say he actually wanted to, because he said he approached you. And I know you ain't going to Yo, this nigga is a liar. I know you said this is your friend, but this is my problem cool. with cool this with person. Him. I'm I, I might cool I might sometimes no nah, I mean I, you say nah, you, you not nah what not nah what not nah nah what right. I said I'm cool with you too so if you as you say you're not Let cool me, with me then, right, no, right, I'm you definitely you, you cool with you it. you're not right. even listening nigga I didn't say all you right, I'm yeah, talking about right. you say you cool with him I am but I am all right well mm-hmm. this is why problem what I have with men that just ain't to me I'm a I'm a stand up nigga if I say something I mean I either get high maybe forgot I said it or if, or if I know what I said I'm gonna be like oh nah yeah I said that or okay. I did that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to make up something to try to make me look like, you know what I mean? So basically, the only thing I don't like about this guy in this scenario is that he's trying to make it seem as if, you know, like I'm pussy and he can he can just get away with it. So I feel like mm-hmm. I feel like this was weird. He made if you could google this, and we don't want to spend too much time on this, nah, but we, it's a relevant did, uh, topic. <laughs> this man has at least 20 blogs talking about me, bro. Like, it got to a point where girls would call me like, yo, what's up with this guy? Why is he obsessed but, but, with but, 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 you? So let me finish. You skipping the whole thing? No, I'm not skipping question. it. I'm going to the, the point. I'm answering it on, on, for a reason. So basically, after doing all of this stuff, I approached him at the first summer madness with my man Sam Scarfo, mm. and all he didn't approach me. I approached him, and I said, bro, what's up? And he's like, yo, come on, I just want to battle you, nigga. Like, you don't fuck with niggas, so let me battle you. Okay. I said, my nigga, and, and this is word to my daughter's life. I said, my nigga, you've been going in since the battle, bro. I don't know you. I don't want to battle you. It's not mm. going to help me from battling you. Unless you got some money to put up or somebody pays me, I have nothing to gain from battle you. So can you stop all this extra shit? That's not going to make me want to battle you. It makes me think you want to fight me. So mm. do you want to fight me or you want to battle me? Word in my life. This is what I asked him. Outside with some of Madness One. Cortez there, D Chain, all these other niggas there. So now it's getting tense because niggas is like, oh, like. So he tries to, in order to try to make it look like I'm not kind of, huh? Puts his hand like on my shoulder, like as if to try to make it look like he's. <laughs> so I slapped his hand. I'm like, yo, bro, what is what's up with you? He I said, you want to like, can we you want to just walk up the block or or what? And he's like, yo, I feel like you keep inviting me to that. I feel like you keep inviting me to that. Hmm. I'm like, nigga, I don't care about you. I never speak about you. I don't want you don't are not on my radar. You're just trying to get my light. Like, stop. I should probably crush him. My nigga. And this is why this type of shit, this shit was burning this nigga's soul. Like he, <laughs> he been really on some groupy so what, what, shit. What, what was the outcome of that? So that the outcome that? was nothing. It was that classic little gay smile he does, like, oh, we good, we good, no. uh, 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 cool. Damn. A nigga. This shit real. I didn't want to battle the nigga when, when what you call it, called me with it. But I For think who? it gave me, I don't, I'm not sure what it was, but it was around. Beasley? Yeah, it was around that good number of, you know, it was tinny. And it was around there. So I, it was summer madness. I didn't want to battle him. He's so not wait, wait, relevant. On. He's only done on, negativity wait, wait, wait. in battle rap. So He's only on. known for snuffing niggas in battles. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. So hold on. I don't want to battle this man because he wasn't even at the status of Joe, mine then. Joe, see, hold on. Go ahead. All right, thank you. So the, after that that happened, summer madness won. Did he stop making the blogs? Was it? He always does little slick, funny, girly, slick mouth shit, my nigga. Okay. So and then acts like somebody else. Is trying to keep shit going by mm-hmm. telling the truth. I right, so it's he crazy. So he did, he didn't stop making the blogs basically. But let's let's go into something else real quick a little bit. We get back to the Mav joint. You uh you had an issue with Beasley up, upstairs. Did no, I had an issue with URL, and the issue was the the video projector. Okay, they asked me to make a video. Niggas said, you know, they have the screens now. Let's make it a movie now. You know what I'm saying? This mm-hmm. is after Lux did the whole shit. So I'm like, damn, I'm thinking, how can I make this a movie? Like, how can I make this relevant to him and it be a big deal? Mm. So I was like, man, they got the movie projectors. I was like, yo. And niggas was like, yo, why don't, niggas don't know what you be on. You know what I'm saying? Like, why don't you just kind of show niggas what you really on? Like, you know what I'm saying? Bring the hoes out. Like, do do your real life. 
Mm. And I'm like, yo, that might be fire. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, matter of fact, that's what we're going to do. So I shot, it's on YouTube, I shot the um, kind of like an intro on some up and smoke tour type shit where you know you see the whole thing and then you come out with what you just seen on the stage. You know what I mean? Mm. So I did the thing with the girls in the telly working, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, you didn't, you ain't even telling us about your rap shit no more. We want to come support. And then boom, the girls come out with me in the body paint. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so I was trying just, to make it a movie. But one, it was it was just weird how I feel like, man, I just feel like I be showing up, man. Like I always come at least put on a good, if not classic performance. So why I can't get the basic things that I'm supposed to have to perform? So if the projector don't work, tell me before two minutes from going on stage, mm. oh, by the way, you can't show your video. My whole shit is geared to this. My whole bars, my whole everything is based off this whole presentation. Now you think you could just tell somebody right before? And now what? I'm just walking on stage with three bitches and people don't know what the fuck is going on? Got so that's what man. happened. That makes sense. So mind you, so, so we, we got, upstairs. Why he got mad to kick the garbage can? Because I because I'm everything. roasting him like, yo, my nigga, this is horrible business. You told me to do something. I prepared for it for months. I'm sitting here with girls butt-ass naked with pain on their bodies, and you watching me do all of this, and you don't tell me nothing about this projector until right now. And it was working with everybody else, though. Mm. So what but what I think what it really was, they didn't want me to show this visual, which was a picture of this nigga with his shirt off looking gay, and the bitches were looking at it laughing like, yo, this is nigga you battling? <laughs> so I think they just did, it looked so bad, I think they just didn't want to do that to him, like, damn, come on. Instead of just saying, ah, man, we fuck with him a little bit, we don't want you fully killing the nigga before the battle even start. So, how, so I think so, that's so, what it was. So, but so I they don't rigged know. it. So you were saying, <laughs> I don't want to, and I don't even want to accuse niggas of that. But that's why the argument was: this is something really serious to argue so about. How, you know so, what I'm saying? So how did it calm down? I saw Beasley's end up kicking some stuff. I don't know if he it, didn't kick nothing. When he kicked I, in the front garbage of me. can, my nigga. He Not in front of me. Can. Maybe after. I don't know. But we definitely, I thought we was definitely about to fight. Good thing we didn't, because I thought apparently this nigga's a fucking MMA. Fighter and all this yeah, shit, yeah, yeah, but he yeah. was definitely fucking mad. Yeah. Yeah, and we was. definitely was about to get it shaken because I'm telling him, my nigga, fuck that. Like, don't do you like those? It's, it's cool. Just no, my nigga, that's not cool, bro. Yeah, yeah. That just fucked my whole performance up, and it did. It made the battle weird. People standing there, they don't know what's going on. That's why the whole shit got weird because he had a bar where he said something about the girls, and um, they reacted right. But then the girls looked at each other. I'm not telling them, yo, twerk during his bars. Yo, do that. Like, that shit is gay. I came to put on a show for y'all thirsty niggas that love seeing these naked bitches and rain car girls. You know what I'm saying? And my bars actually was going to lead to them doing shit. It was real performing arts. You know what I'm saying? But basically, uh, long story short, he said some shit. The girls looked at each other. I was like, fuck that shit. Start twerking and going crazy. And the crowd starts going crazy. So really, he realized his mind, like, there's no way I'm going to win this battle. And, you know, he just did some sucker shit. When when we had mad chances to fight, mad chances to, you know. But I don't think about fighting in battle. All right, hold on. Before, before, we, before we get into that, before we get into that, that, that day, you hold that thought. You, what was your first URL battle? Murder Moot. That time. Smack, 2005. How much time did they try to set up the murder move battle? Honestly, I wanted the murder move battle because at the time, Mook had the streets more than me mm. because he had the DVDs. And I at that point, I was on MTV, but I didn't have the DVD wave like he had it because he had like four battles on Smack. Mm. I had never battled on Smack because I was only battling where I could bet my money and win, mm. and MTV was going to come. You know what I mean? At the time, Smack was still, you know, shout out to Smack and the progress in the UR movement. But at the time, he was filming niggas talking crazy, busting their guns in the air, like hood shit. That shit was moving up. Like. Yeah, facts. But then the, the battle was just like icing on top kind of at the end. It okay. wasn't really a battle league at that time. You know what I'm saying? That's true. Yeah. So I was, you know, more on the professional, like, yo. But, but then I realized, like, man, fuck that. I need the streets, too. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, nah. But this is before the Ludacris joint. Yeah, this is before that. And, um... And yeah, so we set that up, and actually was supposed to go down. So this was my mad shit with this suck ass nigga. It was supposed to go down on Mook's block on One Sixteen, but that's nigga. when the shit happened with uh, the, the the kid Dose, the first nigga he sucker punched in the battle. Hmm. And you know, 
Whatever. And honestly, we got into it that night because I was mad because he ruined it. Now I can't battle Mook. Hmm. So we actually, my barber shop is where we had that battle. I was cutting hair in the barber shop in Harlem. So we had nowhere else to go have the battle now. So I'm like, man, fuck that. We're going to go well, to the barber shop. You got that night. Mad that night? Yeah. Because he, he sucker punched the dude. And I'm like, why the fuck you, you sucker punch this little nigga, man? He, nah, he hit me with his nah, man. He hit me with his hat, man. Fuck that and all that. <laughs> man, this shit is crazy to me because, like, when it, it's real, it's real, man. The coach, this nigga always does clown shit, and they still somehow allow him to sneak back in. So, so, I just mm. don't like it because, to me, it's like, I never started out with nobody. I never had no problem. Y'all ain't never seen me have no rap beef. I ain't never have seen me do nothing sideways to nobody else in terms of, you know what I mean, rap. So Leave that in the streets, man. Facts. Real street niggas don't want rap beef. Facts, though. These niggas only have rap beef and no street shit, though. So you wanted to battle Mook because you wanted the streets. And then the Mook thing prolonged because you're supposed to battle him that day. No. What wound up happening is I said, listen, we could go uptown. I got the barbershop. Mm-hmm. At first, niggas was like, nah, we not going uptown. Because I think, shout out to Mook, that's my nigga now. But they ain't want to leave these block. They want to stay there on 116 where they got the stronghold. So he like, nah, these niggas like, nah, we ain't coming up there, right? I'm like, man, oh, y'all niggas scared. Like, I'm not even from Harlem. I'm from here, but I'm not, nigga, I'm a Jersey nigga. Like, come on, B. Mm-hmm. So I think that was the deterrent move, too, because then niggas stalled me out, and then they went and all shot the head. They hit me like, all right, fuck it, let's do it. But by the time I got there, everybody was there already. You know what I mean? So that's why you see me in the battle saying, I only got a couple people here. Uh, uh, because by that time, the barbershop was so packed that basically was no more room to get in. So it was like, I would even have to kind of tell niggas to leave out. Like, yo, y'all got to get out of here so some of my niggas come in here. So it was like, man, fuck it. Let's just do it. So we just opened the barbershop door. You don't see that on camera, but the doors, we just opened the door. There was mad people outside, and we just got busy. And you feel you won that battle you said too, right? Honestly, that night I didn't. That night I didn't, just because the energy felt like, you know what I'm saying? But it was all his niggas, right? you know, jumping around rehearsing. They ain't going to let me let him look like he losing on smack camera when that's what they've been doing the last five episodes. You know what I'm saying? So mm. it's a blessing now, though, and even then, that a lot of people's like, yo, you killed Mook, because they can see that now in battles. You can see when people are over cheering, because like, now people know how to watch battles. But back mm. then, it was just niggas going crazy on camera. Oh, you know what I mean? But that's why it's a classic, because you got people that say he won, people say I won. All right, cool. You got, you got, last time I'll tell you, you got to take, you it's take of, it's the labels on the other side. You got to take it off completely. You the one gave me this shit. Man. Just take the label off. You too good to <laughs> take the label off? That's dumb. Now I'm too good. See, see how you do it? Yeah, you know what's man. weird? I think it is niggas that really don't like me because they really feel in, inferior. But niggas feel less comfortable with themselves. I'm not saying you. When niggas <laughs> say, he said you're too good. Why, why would I be too good? You I, think just I don't like you, bro. No, you, you like me. But there's uh, a lot of because you a nigga that don't give a fuck. You a confident ass nigga. You take your shirt off with yeah, power rangers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't give a fuck. <laughs> a you know what I'm saying? Think, but there's a lot of niggas cool hell, that they nigga. don't like cool niggas, bro. You my yeah, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You show me a lot of love, my nigga. I never. Yeah, I, I fuck you know, with man. you, nigga. Cause you a cause on the low niggas don't know you a solid nigga. As far as I know. Yeah, I mean, but you know what I'm saying? That's 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 crazy. <laughs> Pause, <laughs> but you know. Yeah, yeah. Let's let's. Whatever. I know what you mean. Let, let, I mean, you stay true to your word, which is very rare in this industry, as far as I see. I just, you know, what's confusing yeah. about the match real quick. You know, you go on calling an angry fan, doing those interviews. But when I had an interview, I'm not calling anybody. Oh, he called you. We oh, angry but, fan. We have all kinds of interviews. But, not but, me calling people. All right, but when, but when but when but when I did it with you in the car, I paused. Yeah. yeah. The interview joint. You asked me not to put it out. Well, you know what the problem is? And you was talking crazy. And no. I spoke to Matt, well, too. And Matt said, don't put it out, too. Actually, actually, what happened is he asked you not to put it out, right? You said, I well, was, he asked me, he said, don't put it out. I called you. You said, I was thinking the I same said, thing. I said, okay. Don't I didn't ask man. you not to put it out. No, no. He, he asked thinking, you not to put it out. You said, you know what, Flip? I was thinking the same thing. I was thinking the same okay. thing. Okay. All, all right, right. But all right. I didn't tell oh, you, you not to put it out. He did. He said it first. He asked you not. All right, come on. Hello. So we have the facts. Let's keep facts all right, straight. All right, all right, all right. He asked you not to put it out, put it out flip. because you know why he asked you not to put it You're out? You're so crazy. That's not why he asked you not but to put I'm it t- out. T- he asked you not to put it out because he don't want people to know the truth, man. That's why he asked you not to put it out. Why would you give a fuck if it's not true? So why would you think about the same thing then? Because and I don't want to keep that- drama going. Okay. But the difference is 
And and I'm gonna just let, let's just get all this out. People watch this shit, and you know he was here talking shit. I'm just gonna eradicate what's not true, and we are gonna get on to positive things, man. Mm. But I I seen him after, so a lot of people know. All right, cool. Sucker punched me on stage. I was out of it. Choked me. I couldn't really get up. He runs out the building. Mm-hmm. I got no chance to shoot a fair one. No nothing. All right, cool. So in my mind, okay. at this point, honestly, I'm a I'm you know I'm thirty. Something that I'm 30 at that point, you know what I'm saying? I done been through my whole life. I've had all kinds of fights. I've been stabbed up. I've been shot at. I've done been in hospitals, surgeries, every kind of jail fights, everything. Mm. You know what I mean? I got scars all over my body. So for a nigga that chill, nigga, he like, now nah, you trying to sound too tough. No, this no, nigga's no, crazy. No, 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 so no, 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 no. chill, <laughs> nigga. So I'm saying this to say, I'm saying this to say, nigga. I'm saying this to say. I'm about to G check him right now because he had a situation with goods too. It's it's nothing to G check. I, I, I keep G-check it honest right about now. everything. I, I, I G check you right now. It's nothing to G check. Number one, it's nothing to G Number one, this is why I kept going with math, nigga, because he said it, nigga. Because I did see a blog after of you not saying. What really happened on what, the stage? What really happened? No, what I said, and I'll correct that now, what I said was, and I, was I wasn't was looking at him. What I said, I wasn't looking at him when he stole me, right? That's what I said, right? But I didn't see the video yet, and honestly, I didn't remember what happened before the moment of it, right? Mm. What happened was, okay. a nigga was rapping, no one give a fuck about what he was saying because it was trash. Mm. I wasn't looking at him. Biz was twerking over here. I was just like this, standing there. He said some bar that was supposed to be hard, and just like, argh, argh. And I and don't I do that. And, I don't like that. That's my man. Don't do that. He knows what I'm talking about. That's why it's so funny. I was there. And I go like this. Like, cause honestly, he jumped in my face when I'm not looking at him. So I'm like, woo. All right, nigga, woo. Fuck you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. On some like, okay, fuck you want from me from that. Steals me. Yes. Yeah, cool. So what I said we have about this scenario. But I don't have it. I what I said mm-hmm. about this scenario was. You know, the girls were shaking. I said I was looking at the bitch twerking. I was. But in the moments before that, it wasn't at the moment. Mm-hmm. Okay. But I, I turned around, boom, stole me. That's not enough time to prepare for you thinking a nigga going to fight you. I mean, any, any cap in anybody. You know what okay. I'm saying? But cool. I'm this type of nigga. I'm not going to do a bunch of blogs about it. I did a Vlad interview because he asked me to talk about it. And I did one other one. Everything else is somebody asking me, and I'm just saying the answers. I don't. I didn't do a bunch of blogs about it. This nigga did a blog with his mom. He said it on oh, here, talking about say I'm a good kid. But you didn't see what it, type though? of grown man? Nigga seen it. Who saw it? Nigga, my man seen. He's like, yo, look at this shit. He deleted this shit. <laughs> I'm like, yo, my nigga. And this is all I'm gonna say. I don't know what type of guy that is, but I've never gotten a fight or no street drama as a grown man and asked my mom to come. And say I'm a guy. Like, I don't even know what that means. On, well, I, all I'm going to say is, listen, all I'm going to say is uh, this. I'm this type of guy. I'm not going to dwell on it. When I see you, I'm popping. Mm. That's it. It's no discussion, no nothing. He's trying to make this shit, this story up of I saw you and you were right there and he wasn't looking at me. So I, my nigga, first of all, the niggas I'm around, if I don't pop on you and I'm sitting right here, I'm not allowed to be around no more. Mm. I don't know what you talking about. My niggas don't play that. Shout out to Timeless. I'm in Miami. My niggas got the stronghold of Miami, my nigga. It's not a joke. Mm. So niggas I'm with see him in the cut across the fucking way while I'm there with a stripper from Tootsies and 20 other niggas. Even in the picture he took, you see me looking this way with a chick in front of me on the side of me or whatever. So you sneaking over there to take, wow, what kind of man even thinks like that? Let me try and do something else to look like this man is pussy, so I could look. So he takes a picture, I guess, whatever he does. Okay, and my homie Chung and Jug, they come up to me, the little homies. This is this is the big homie's sons and all that, but niggas still fuck around in the club and all that together. He comes up to me, yo, your man over there just took a picture, yo. Niggas made him delete it out the phone. Hmm. Yo, my nigga, that's not funny. I'm not playing like that. Like, don't joke me like that, my nigga, dead ass. No, nah, for real, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? We we for real, nigga. Was standing right there, took a picture of you. And niggas ran down on him, made him delete it. I was like, word, where the fuck is he at? They pointed. He's standing behind the table on a cut like this with two other niggas, right? I'm like, oh shit. I'm like, you serious? He did that? They like, what you want us to do? I'm like, nah, don't do nothing. I purposely, I grabbed the bottle. I tried to go over there by myself. 
You know what I mean? My nigga Jay, I ain't gonna say his name, saw what I was doing and was like, nah, it came with me. You know what I'm saying? But I tried to fake him out. I tried to fake him around the table because he's standing behind the table. Mm. He got two people there. I can't really get at him or do nothing like that. So I tried to finesse him around the table. I tried to be like, yo, come on, like holler. But he know, he seen me, guy that he he probably was watching me the whole time. So he seen my movement. So he know like, nah, this nigga, you know what I mean? So I'm like, yo, just come around the table, right? I'm trying to break this nigga head with this bottle, right? <laughs> so he comes around the table, but he was smart enough to know that it was on. So he just kind of like rushed at me and I ain't really get to full fledging, but I like hit him in the back of the head with the bottle, like boom. And it was a big boom, and niggas start, you know what I mean? Now, like wrestling, tussling, uh, uh, uh. To be honest, like he said, he got away. How are you fighting with two other people? I don't know niggas' logic. My niggas, we come together, we leave together. There's no way you go into the hospital and I'm just not there. The bouncers had you. Ain't no bouncers had that nigga. I was fighting, we wound up fighting the bouncers. Cause if you've seen the video, it's 20 niggas after they after because after my man J Pop, the whole team is popping off off a strip of him. It ain't even just me. You know what I'm saying? So they seen the big homie going at now they're watching the whole equation. So niggas is getting stomped out, all this kind of extra shit. One nigga, I'm not gonna say his name. I want to just, you know what I mean, the valley, but it's disrespectful because nigga got staples all in his head, mm. all this kind of shit. And this supposed to be the niggas you with. You left these niggas. To get beat the fuck down and get staples in their head and get sent to the hospital. And you ran the same way you did when you stole me or whatever and you, you got the fuck up out of Dodge. You ain't say afterwards, nah, I'm going to wait out here till that nigga he can get his fair one. Mm. You don't do that. There was plenty of times I could afford it. My nigga, after here. this, no, this is what I'm going to tell you. After this now, I didn't say no blogs about it. I didn't say nothing. I did a video clip on, this was back when it was 15 seconds too. Mm. And I said, it's not, I had blood all over me. You know what I mean? And my lip was a little, and I said, this is not my blood. Turn up. That's it. I didn't say who, what, nothing. He comes out with a whole, and this is months after our shit happened, so you don't know who the fuck it could be. He comes out with a whole blog explanation of, this is, it's, you know, we, this and this, and showing his head, and I'm good, you see I ain't fucked up. And goes on a whole campaign explaining the whole fight and the whole story. I didn't explain oh, that story ever until right now. I have never talked about our fight in Miami. I've never said what happened. I would love to have y'all both in the, in the room so, at the same time. Nah, stories, I ain't going to be nothing to talk about because you this is what I'm saying? saying. This is all facts, my nigga. Nah, I, I this get is it. But you know, grown man that just does whole shit, bro. After this, he called my nigga Shampoo. He's calling around. We need to sit down. Mm. If you look at I don't know if he probably deleted by now, but Twitter's forever. He got all these tweets tweeting me after this. We got kids. We got to think about our lives. Now we got to <laughs> think about our lives of kids? Yeah, yeah. I'm not, I, I'm not saying I, I'm done with talking I'm about not saying you, nigga, I, nigga, I'm not saying you're not valid This is what you know, happened hold on, hold on. This is what happened Why do you do that? Stop, stop, stop talking man Please man. <laughs> no, I, I, Stop Stop just, I'm yeah, like, look, hey, My nigga stop I'm not, I'm, I'm not saying it's not valid But what's, when, when you with somebody The first time And they tell their part of the story And then someone else Tell the second part, second part of the story It's like alright you know what I'm saying? You don't know who to believe. Yeah, it's like... I don't know how you don't know who to believe when a nigga lying on your thing. He did a whole story where he talked about the Miami fight. Then he then on here, then known. on here, he, don't watch he said it, a he whole nother know. version. Yeah, he wouldn't yeah. know. He don't watch it. He don't watch Battle Well, you know that. I don't know that either. I don't know what happened. <laughs> You know what he said happened. <laughs> I know he said, but I, don't know I just, happened. I'm just thinking in my head like, I'm fight. just thinking, I'm, I'm hearing, facts. I'm hearing the story, I'm hearing the story you were saying. Stick to the facts, man. The facts of the matter is that you acting like. What I'm acting like? You acting like this is, what I, this is the problem I have, and and, and I do like you, but that's the, 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 no, no, I have to say it. I like it. Don't no, do it. I love it. The, the, prob, <laughs> the problem I have with him is this. All right, he admitted that he said because of certain things transpired, how math act that he he come off cocky. If you don't know, you ain't cool. cool. That may rub people the wrong way. Got it. Right. Yeah. Got it. May rub me the wrong way, somebody else, but he has a valid reason. That's him. He want to act like that. You can't tell a man how to act. Facts. Correct? Will you give me a agree on that? Facts. Then you hear how he talk now. Look how he talk. He just talk. That's how he talk. He always been talking like My that. My nigga, this is the truth. <laughs> the truth. All right, <laughs> how I'm talking. You're talking about your commentary, probably. Yeah, you do the slick. The way comment. I'm saying it sounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Too let me finish. Let me finish. So <laughs> good, like. What the fuck? But you had, but you said something crazy to my man Goods, and you had an issue with them, right? I was honestly, I was, I was wrong for with, with good situation. Uh, then, oh, well, okay. As a good, man, uh, you I know, with that. a daughter, <laughs> I said something. I respect and I that. I involved his daughter, and I shouldn't have did that. Okay. So as a man, I was wrong. 
You know what I'm saying? Well, I respect but that. but I, I did that in retaliation though. To because him? he was a, another one he was trying to bait me to battle him. He kept using certain words and he said pussy. And my nigga, I don't know where I'm from. You don't call a man pussy unless you want other problems. That's not battle rap shit. Where we at? So where, I said something to... that was I'm not gonna say exactly what I said, but he's always posting and being with his, you know, with his daughter. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I said something to the effect of I was basically trying to convey the message of saying, bro, you don't want to do that, and we don't want to do that because what if I just did this and it'll be in front of your daughter? Mm -hmm. Which, he told which, you that. which, remember, which was. Just the thought of that now, if somebody said that to me, yeah. knowing that I got a daughter, and just bringing my mind to that level, I'm going to go offensive. I'm going to think, was this, oh, nah. Was this face-to-face -face I mean, or was this online? This was on Twitter. So how did what, you know what what, how did the situation, so y'all saw each other? No, we never saw each other. I never got into it with him. It was one of his niggas that I still don't know who it was, but they, I'm not going to say what happened, but basically nothing happened. Something did happen. Something <laughs> something happened. Something happened, happened to your car. Something, no, nothing happened to a car. Nothing happened to a car. Something that could have happened crazy, could have went crazy, did it. And so honestly, you, it. you were smart enough that you made it. You rectified it right there. I, I, honestly, I felt like you were good talker, I so. felt like if it wasn't for me, you know, going to the next extra mile with it, then it wouldn't have went there. You know what I'm saying? So I'm man enough to where I look at it. I mean, like, but how did, how did it rectify with him and his man that you got into? Because you you got into it with somebody. I saw him. What happened was after that scenario happened, then I saw him. And I saw him, you know, I kind of was like, yo, your man you sent was was pussy, right? And he was like, you know, he said what he said. Like, nah, he said, well, this just happened, so that's why niggas ain't, you know what I mean, get to do you. So I'm like, all right, man, well, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, that shit corny, my nigga. Like, uh, uh. And basically, you know, as men, we just said, you know, it's dead. We saw each other in a place where we couldn't really get busy. It was at Total Slaughter. You know what I'm saying? There's a bunch of people in the room, cameras, everything. So I basically just called them in the room. You know what I'm saying? And I was I was gonna take it the whole other way, but honestly, why this is you, rap uh, shit, uh, man. Why would you don't take it? Why would you take it the whole other way if nothing really happened to your car? Man? I heard what happened to your car. Car? What car? I heard something happened, man. Nothing your, happened man one to of your car. people's cars or something. Nigga. It wasn't about a car, bro. Something happened with with, 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 with with things was pulled out, man. We don't have to talk things about that. Were, a thing was pulled out, but nothing happened to no car. So uh, nothing was let off. I'm a t listen. I'm just asking you. <laughs> I'm just asking a you. Nigga was, a nigga ran down and didn't do nothing, and I chased him away. <laughs> he actually ran away with the blicky, and that's all my wow. daughter. He let off a shot, and I was like, oh, shit. I, look, I couldn't tell who it was, and the nigga looked at me, and his eyes got big. He turned around and ran. That's word to everything I love. Omar Wilson, as my nigga asked him on Instagram, his, Omar he was there, he was standing right next to me with his friend. And they were all looking at me like, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm like, I don't know, but I was so mad. But why, you think saw... he, why you think he ran? Because you could have been police behind I, you? Nah, nah, nah. I think what it was, he was trying to scare me and I didn't get scared. So he was trying to scare me and I ain't get scared. So I guess what you gonna do now? <laughs> so you never had a conversation with this man? I don't know who this Yo, was. Okay. And I didn't want to say this, you know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to keep drama going, but nah, let's no just drama. keep the nah. real shit. You know but there's no yeah. drama out so, there? So long story short, I was out of pocket though. I brought a nigga's child into the scenario of our beef. I didn't have to do that. You were wrong. So uh, I looked at it like I was wrong. Your man you, was did, pussy. I didn't get hit. Did you apologize you know I mean? for it though? I didn't really apologize. Why not? But you too good to apologize? But I am, I mean, I'm now. Because he, the way he carried it was like, I thought what he was doing was corny. Because it's like, if I got an issue with you, see me. You see me. Don't try to have niggas sneak up on me when I got a show in the Bronx somewhere. Sneaking out the alley when I'm leaving at four in the morning. You know what I'm saying? I looked at it like, you know. But at the same time, I mean, it's real shit. So apologize, You man. know. I was. I just. You know. Yo. yo. Just say sorry. What's wrong? With saying sorry. Yo. What's wrong with apologize? Right. No, it's right? It's 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 in that road, they just. Yeah, road, it's, 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 apologize. I'm not apologize to a camera. If I'm why apologize, you apologize I'm talk to a man. No. Why you get apologize? To, you just said, nigga. You just. You just said a whole bunch of. My nigga. We well, get to watch the nigga show. It's the flip the script show. We why you can't say you sorry? I'm not saying sorry to a man through a camera lens on an interview, my nigga. So you apologize him when you see him. Maybe. No, it's no maybe. You just made I just said I was wrong. Damn, you know my fault, my <laughs> All right, my bad. Damn. Uh, All right, on. hold it.
Grizzy. 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 Crazy, man. Sorry, Grizzy. Oh we go, this yeah, is classic. This guy's good at this. Let's talk, let's talk, let's talk, let's talk to Grizzy one time. Grizzy. I'm sorry, Grizzy. I got but some I questions for Grizzy, man. I don't want you to man. have no misconstrued facts because a lot of people be trying to use all this, all this fake beef no, in I'm, battles. Not, not, they not, don't know what happened, but they trying to say shit yeah. happened. I'm just trying to if show you. If you chase a nigga away that got a gun in his hand, that's not really. Why you keep going? I'm just trying to show you that you have a you have a consistent. Behavior of being disrespectful to people. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to show you. It does. You can't make crazy it crazy about this nigga. Oh, man. You, you keep trying to go back to proving that point, which is weird. The mm -hmm. stories we telling mm -hmm. are people that are coming at me. What are you talking about? Who's coming at I you? I got to let people just talk shit about me all the time and not say nothing you just, disrespectful you just said, back. You just said a nigga said he wanted to do a record I said with a you. nigga, no, I said a and nigga. he said he was corny. Because the way he came over, he said, math? Yeah, yeah, I'm just showing you, I'm just no, going No, I line. knew he was a clown. I could tell. He sued people. He put his moms in blouse. He oh, steals man. niggas. But he didn't do that before. He don't, he he don't do, do nothing you. real for the culture. He's right, a cool, crab cool, nigga, cool, cool. bro. It's okay. I'm not fucked up for not fucking with crabs. What's wrong with you? I got to fuck with these niggas? Or I'm uh, I'm disrespectful? My nigga, Stop trying nigga. to prove that point by me not so fucking not with niggas. You're not disrespectful? Hell no. Who I'm disrespectful to? You, you, so you're not a disrespectful person? When I'm battling people, hell yeah. But outside, when people try to communicate with you, you just said Ooh. you said something about the nigga daughter, you're disrespectful. Bro, yo, I uh, know you're trying to make ratings and shit, but said, like, uh, it's, it's getting me, corny. Hold on, hold on. My nigga, I just told shut you a nigga up, was man. coming on, at me. Hold on, I just told you a nigga was coming at me. You sound dumb. Like, what are you, you talking about? You talking to the wrong nigga. Nobody needs I just to said, you. Shut I just up, nigga. said you nigga Nobody was coming at me. Nobody trying to get ratings over you, so, nigga. So shut if up. a nigga's coming stupid. at me. So. I'm trying to tell you, nigga, your fucking behavior, your consistent behavior. Say that you talking to Beasley. Say that you talking to Beasley on top of the fucking second floor. Tell him he do bad business. You have a disrespectful person, nigga. How is that disrespectful? Disrespectful. Say, yeah, I'm disrespectful to niggas that I feel is a fit. That's it, nigga. I'm trying to show you that you have. A, uh, That's a not being a disrespectful person, I'm trying to brother. show you you have a consistent behavior, a pattern of being a disrespectful nigga, my nigga. Where? Be three niggas. Be all okay, right. So you telling me a nigga that I beat in a battle and I wasn't his friend? Okay. That's disrespectful. No, it, a nigga yeah. that's coming at me and called me pussy and I said something about let's not do a confrontation because it could be in front of kids. Mm -hmm. That means I'm I'm disrespectful. And that a nigga that basically ruined a performance that's on summer madness too without warning me five minutes before by me telling him Great. that means I'm disrespectful. It's the Doing way these three things it's the are way disrespect. You, it's the way you talk. You know this already. I watch you tell the man. The man, okay, your, your reason is valid that you explain now. But these are your only examples. Give me Hold something valid. I don't know. I'm just talking about I don't know you outside. All I, right, so what are you talking about? I'm, I'm talking about from what I know, nigga. These are not disrespectful acts, nigga. What That's is standing called? up for yourself as an artist, as a brand, as a man. Fuck is you talking about? I'm talking exactly what the fuck I'm saying. That don't make sense, nigga. It what you talking make sense. about? You just sound stupid. You don't want to admit that you are, you know what, Flip, you know what, you have a point. What do you think? That's it. Let's weigh somebody. What do you, do you think those are disrespectful acts? I'm not gonna lie. If you talking from the beginning of what you said, if somebody's coming at you like, "Yo, I set up studio," that's that's a little suspect. That's that's suspect. Wait, because did I tell him it? So you do? No, so so not, a nigga text no, you no, on no. Twitter and say I set up. He said you agreeing with you. You're not paying you attention, nigga. You don't listen. I thought you said if a nigga. No, I'm saying you're saying a suspect for him. Yeah, I'm saying that if 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 Pardon if me, I, I, I'm if, if, if what anymore. you saying right now, like. About the studio and Tay Rock, and, and we was in the fucking and, and, and where were we with Tay Rock? And I'm I, I with forgot you, you, told, you told Tay Rock, so I forgot what you said, but it made him get mad. You just talk crazy, nigga. I get paid to talk crazy. You talk crazy. Fuck talk, you talk about? But, but you talk the craziest out of all of us. Listen, listen, listen. Fuck is you talking listen, about? That's not the point. This nigga's crazy. You trying to prove a point that I talk crazy by talking back to people talking crazy to me? <laughs> did you or did you not disrespect Tay Rock? What the fuck is he talking what about? What did you say to Tay Rock when, when Tay Rock had to get uh, disrespectful? Nigga, there? first of all. I don't give a fuck if another nigga had to get disrespectful. Okay, all right. Nigga, first of all. But so don't play victim. Second of all, ain't nobody talking no victim, nigga. I ain't nobody talking no victim. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Tell me. Like you just trying to prove a negative point that's not true, nigga. No, because you don't want to admit I'm a very it. respectful, cool nigga. You are I cool. fuck with everybody. I don't disrespect nobody that don't disrespect me first. All right, so what happened so with So stop Tay trying to paint that picture. So what happened with Tay Rock, nigga? Shit. So what happened with Tay Rock? What happened with Tay Rock is we were supposed to battle. That's whack. Hold on, listen, listen. I'm not no. I'm not coming at you, Flip. I'm saying that's whack. All right. Stop trying to prove some point that you know ain't true. All right, what happened? I thought you said facts. 
think that is some facts. She trying to say a nigga's just a whack Yo, nigga. Listen, I'm listen, disrespectful listen, listen, to listen, people because I'm listen, coming back at niggas. Listen, listen, this is what I, this is the fuck I'm. You didn't, didn't, this is what the that, fuck I'm right, talking not about, fact. my nigga. Whack. This is what I'm whack, talking whack, about. Whack. You say it, choose words to say that's disrespectful, all right, bro. All right, that's now you trying to use that to make. It's okay. Right, as a nigga yeah. coming at me, see, I'm not disrespecting you though. I'm not disrespecting you. That's disrespectful, nigga. I'm telling you, you have a tendency. You sitting in front of the world trying to paint my character as a disrespectful. You cool? I just said you cool. That's not true. You, you want some facts shit then, nigga. Fuck you talking about. Right. You want some facts shit then. You want some facts shit then. Right. Well, if I'm on some facts shit, you want some facts shit. Let's not be on some facts shit. So let's ahead, not be so, sensitive. So, let's not I, argue. I, I respect. So let's, let's not so be so arguing. So let's talk about Tay Rock then. Let's talk about Tay Rock. Tay Rock, I'm battling Sharon October 21st in Canada, okay? Sharon is a white guy from Canada, Ottawa. I saw him wilding out. He looks like Pee Wee Herman a little bit in the face. You know what I'm saying? He's wilding in a bag of trapper keepers. But he's nice, right? But Jersey. When you talk about Jersey and battle rap, honestly, Jersey crowd's a hood crowd. It's a street crowd. You know what I'm saying? Arsenal hit me and was like, yo, I want to get you on U-Dub. Honestly, I was flattered because I just killed him in, in the Bay. You know what I'm saying? We just battled on Mr. Fab's League, and that's on YouTube, too. Check that out. And um, I was like, damn, that's dope. That he even wanted to book me. Like, after that, I was like, you a real nigga. I, I, that's what's up. So he was like, you know, who you want to, you know, whatever. We threw out a couple of names. Tay Rock came up. I'm like, yeah, I'll battle Rock, you know what I'm saying? Because he been said before, yo. Uh. So I was like, yeah, let's see if we can set that up, whatever, right? I ran into him at a URL event, you know what I'm saying? And um, he's like, I'm going to kill you, pointing. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you, old head. I'm like, let's, let's do it, nigga. I, talked to, I already talked to Austin about it. He's like, yeah, I already know. I'm like, all right, cool. So, you know what I mean? I'm going to see you then, nigga. We ain't going to talk long. He's like, all right, cool. Bomb, pound. That was it, right? Next thing I know, um, I sent the tweet out maybe weeks after that. It says something like, you ready? He ain't respond. Or he said something. He did respond. He said, you can't be serious. So I don't know if he's saying, you know, whatever he's saying. Then all of a sudden, Arsenal was telling me, yo, um, yeah, so he balanced Sharon. And, um, but, you know, I got old Solo for you. What? You know what I mean? No disrespect to old Solo. You know what I mean? My first loss. <laughs> but I think it's just like, come on, bro. You know what I mean? So I really felt the way, the fact that I could either not get my second, you know, get my bread, which I needed, honestly. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, damn, man. All right, fuck it. I need this bread, so fuck it. I'm going to do it, right? But I was annoyed that I had to do it, honestly. Mm -hmm. And I only had to do it because you backed out. The Battle of White Boy in Jersey, that Sharon's nice, but they don't know him here. They don't want to battle him. You just ducked. You literally ducked. He told me to my face we was going to do it. We shook on it. We don't got to put in a contract, nigga. You ducked. You know what I'm saying? So he was trying to play it off like, like I wasn't going to say nothing about it. You know what I'm saying? I said it in the battle, but people don't know what's true or not. You know what I'm saying? So when we was backstage, y'all talking shit, I'm saucy at battles, usually having fun. Usually when I'm on camera, I'm drinking. I'm just, you know what I mean, in my element. I'm a fan of the culture. I like this shit. So I had to fuck with him, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Technically, I'm only here because this nigga ducked in, cause he, and he's like, you lost to Uso. That's when he kept saying, you lost to him, you lost to him. You ain't see him saying nothing about he was supposed to battle me because mm. he wasn't. He didn't want to address that. Mm. Basically, that's the only reason that started. That was playful. Okay. And then it got, you know, that's his move. He's always yelling. It's not about fighting, you know? So, and he didn't say nothing really disrespectful until the end of it when he walked away and we was all separated. And then he was like, man, fuck that. Suck my dick or some shit that I saw on camera. But we was arguing about battle rap. You see, I was smiling in that. I don't get mad at that. You know what I mean? That's just two battle rappers going at it. It's not you, real. It's not disrespect. It's not, you know what I'm saying? But you don't right, feel right. you beat old Solo. You, you didn't beat him. I, mean, okay. I, I was there. All right, cool, man. Whatever you I was there. Okay, it's blue. You had the other <laughs> nigga come out in a, with a mask <laughs> on. I mean, it. listen, bro. I know that you're playing devil's advocate I'm not or whatever you're doing. <laughs> but my thing is, there's a lot of people that really don't know my character. That okay. There's a lot of people. We talking that, about the battle. A lot of people, no, just in the, as the music oh, in general. business. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. There's oh, a lot I of people. And saying. there's a lot of people that tried to float that rumor. Because I am passionate about my shit. I do go hard for my shit. You know what I'm saying? But all you got to do, oh, mm -hmm, yeah, yeah. do is explain, though, my nigga. All right, I'm, I'm explaining. A nigga, a, nigga, a nigga can't tell me from what I've said. Can I finish explaining, though? Nigga. Can I explain? I'm going to get to my man after you explain, and then I'm going to come right. back to what I, the all total right. slaughter. It's yeah, all good. Yeah, so, long story Don't short. Don't tell me it's all good, because it's not all good. I, not, feel, I feel a way. 
How you gonna feel about it? I feel away because you trying to like act like I'm, you know, like I'm. You, you said, know, like, dumb. Do you want to rewind this? You said I have a pattern of being disrespectful to people. You said that. I did. And and these people that you're talking about are people that are all were disrespectful to me first. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so it's okay. kind of crazy to say Beasley, to me. You said Beasley was disrespectful by not the projector. That's why you consider no, disrespectful. No, I didn't. I, First of all, I wasn't disrespectful to Beasley. We See, had a conversation where mm -hmm. our voices, we were arguing, or it looked like we were arguing, mm -hmm. over an issue that me and him know about. That's not nobody's business. But when you're in a venue and you're at the top of the balcony where you everyone are. can see you from you the are. ground, and it's like, oh, those two are arguing. Y'all don't know what the fuck we arguing about. Okay. All you know right. what I'm saying? I'm telling you now this is what we arguing about. All right, Nobody nah. knew that. I didn't put the business out there. I, I knew it already. You know what I mean? I knew but that's what I'm saying. Okay. This is where niggas need to judge people's character about, man. Okay, yeah. I didn't go bitching about it online and making a big whatever. I didn't tell these stories about what happened with goods. I didn't tell this story about what happened with Miami and Matt. I didn't tell none of this. And I kind of came out the victor in all of these stories. So what's sideways about me? I guess, I guess, I guess. I don't understand. I guess the, I guess the term I should have said is that, that the, 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 the wordings that you use during an argument can, can, can trigger something. Bro, I'm a very, I'm a what? very piercing the, individual. The wording that, words, right, right, right. I'm a right. battle rapper. So let me say yeah. that. Bro, yeah. listen. That's honestly, like me, you arguing like, nigga. I'm going to say it like this. And without soft, without sounding tough, tough, without sounding tough, I'm going to say it like this. And, and the future going to show. I never wanted to be somebody. I come from the era where I want you to respect my talent, man. Sure. I'm not trying to be Mr. Tough Guy Rapper. I never tried to be that way. If you look at my battles, I'm smiling most of the time. I'm cracking jokes. Even my songs, I'm just starting to tell the truth about my life, my cases, my drama, what I've been through, my family. I never even tell you that to the world. So I'm keeping all this shit in here. Cause I don't even want to be looked at in that type of way. And you got niggas trying to paint my character as some whole type of other nigga. Just cause I'm not telling the truth. Just cause I'm not telling niggas about what's really going on. So that does make me feel a way. Mm -hmm. Cause you got people in the industry that's running with false images of me because so what something happened. Somebody said, and I did have a when I did have a deal, right? A lot of people try to, you know, paint something. Oh, well, what's up with Jones? What happened? And try to say it's like something with me. Instead of just saying, well, yo, Jones, Jones really is famous. He can't do regular shit. We do need a situation where he's supported. He can't be sitting in the back of promotional vans just looking weird with a chain on. That It's a bad look. Jones, what's up with you? You with these niggas? But that's not good. I got to ride for my shit. I got to go shake a DJ's hand. I got to be like, yo, this is my single. What, I'm going to just stand there and just die out? That's what niggas want you to do. They think you crazy because you believe in yourself. Fuck out of here, nigga. I'm going to be crazy then. If y'all niggas want to act like just because I know what the people come up to me and say every day in the street, I got to live with me. I got to walk around with this face and see people like, yo, my nigga, I've been watching you since fucking 2005. Like, I just heard this. I just watched that. What's up? When you coming? My nigga, I'm coming. I'm going hard. I'm not going to turn my passion down because other people don't want to admit you a star. And that's just what it is, my nigga. To be honest, all all cockiness okay. included, I guess. Talk to him, Jones. No, 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 don't hate that nigga. Come on, my nigga. Like, <laughs> all right, we go. All right, all right, all right. Calm I down. I don't like the. I get because it, it happens, and people people be having some funny vibe for what they heard about me and don't know nothing about but, me. First of all, first of all, first of all, not, not you, you not, tight, you, not you. I don't have no funny not vibe. Not you. To this. See, you be taking shit personal. I don't mean you. I have to. But when you say something like that, somebody else might. That's what I'm saying. I'm just trying to. I, I, but you can address. You can say. I, I, I corrected myself. And I'm going Thank to say you, I'm going to say why I came up with this before I started hearing things. When I met him, he was a nice guy. He is a nice guy. I told you. I said I like him. He's just friendly, cool. <laughs> we laugh. He offer you food. You want something? He's cool. <laughs> Girls and all that. I'm when saying, I, I'm giving when, niggas when I heard like, Damn. when I saw listen it's when I saw I when I saw Matt pull him to speak to him. I saw Matt ask him. And what Joe said, I'm in my. Let's get to that. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. We'll get to that after. Let me talk to that to this nigga Grizzly. Hold on. Let me just say. Let's not get to that. Wait, hold on, hold on. Not at all. We'll get to that because I'm just gonna let you know why I came up with my conclusion. What he said there, I remember me standing there like. Why would you say that? The nigga trying to be peaceful now. We in total slaughter. I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with this nigga? Right? You know I why you thinking that? In my mind, I'm like, why you is he why you like that? You didn't, I didn't know. You didn't know the whole, you know the whole story. I, I, let, let you finish, my bad. I didn't know. The, you go say I didn't know the whole story. But let me, no, let, that's not what I was going to say. What you say? Say what you say. Because I was going to say, you know why you thinking that? Because you thinking he's the aggressor of the scenario. You thinking, why would Jones provoke him? 
Like he's the tough guy of the scenario because he sucker punches niggas. Instead of Probably. thinking, instead of thinking, Probably. my nigga, we I, had to tell, I had to tell niggas not to kill this nigga. Like, don't do this. We're it's going to ruin my life. In, don't do it. We're in total mm. slaughter. And I'm you like, thinking, you, instead no, no. of your mind, you you think you could just walk up to me like it's cool. Well, I, I didn't think, no, you defend, no, no, not defending yourself. You defending yourself him. well. I'm just not saying. Him. Just, I'm saying, I'm saying, my nigga, we this nigga, slaughter. this is what happened. Well, Mr. Fab, Mr. Fab, I thought we was about to get it shaken. I didn't want to be the bad guy, though, again. Because, one, I saw you. We got it shaken. You got about a dodge. Lied about it. I see you again. I still, honestly, didn't feel satisfied. The world don't know I fucked you up. Hmm. And they and they saw me get snuck. So I kind of honestly still felt the way. He said he felt so, the way. And I said that. I'm a real nigga. Don't come up to me trying to be uh, bro-y, bro When my nigga, I still want to hurt you. Fuck hmm. is you talking about, nigga? Just because you want to be cool now? No, nigga, it ain't cool. Fuck is you talking about? Hmm. I'm going to do you dirty if I get a chance. Let's go. So... I'm just saying, you 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 coming up to me and Mr. Fab basically did what Mr. Fab basically did, cause that's my brother and he's a peaceful nigga. That's about these are my friends, mm -hmm. real cool niggas that do shit for the community and people and want to see people getting along. That's my one of my best friends and he basically saw the energy and was like, "Come on, man, y'all niggas need to dead that shit, man. Dead that right or wrong." I saw. He that. was like, "Yo, y'all need to dead that shit, right?" Yeah. And, and 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 he's like, "Yo, what's up, man?" So. Good man, come on man. He did that. He did that. <laughs> <laughs> like, but you were surprised. That's his, some pretty old school shit, man. Okay, okay. His, so I'm like, bro. His niggas was there. Like, yo, you know what? And you I'm told, like, yo, I'm like, sit yo, back to the mic. Like, I'm yeah. like, yo, bro, like, right or wrong, flip. I'm like, <laughs> like this, y'all, bro. I saw that. Yeah, you know I mean, like, I saw that. And he like, come on, man, come on, man. Like, let's just squash this shit. Let's squash shit. Yeah, I saw that. All right, man. Shook the niggas' hand, right? All right, man. Yo, we good. We good. Nah, no, we good. You sure? I'm sure, man. All right, come on. Let's take a picture. Am I lying, Flip? Keep going. All right. Let's take a picture. <laughs> picture? Y'all, my nigga, like, nah. We're I'm not, not doing no that. Picture, I'm not taking bro. that. I'm not We're not doing a picture that. With yeah. you. Well, if I, where if I got a photographic memory, nigga. I remember what, that. What, tell me if I, it's word for word. But you, you're not uh, saying that his I know, around No, you. hold up. Okay. So if you don't want to take a picture, I feel like it's still beef or something then, man. The picture is like. We cool now. This is what this nigga said. <laughs> bruh. Yo. My nigga, listen. bro. I'm not taking no picture with you because he's like, well, I still think you feel the type of way. I say, you fucking right. I still feel the type of way, nigga. You stole me. You stole me in front of the world when you had mad chance to fight me. You've been on my dick for 10 years. You didn't say to, that. Mm. I, I didn't say that part, but I feel this in my okay. mind. Mm -hmm. But yeah, nigga, of course we ain't cool. You know what I'm saying? You said that. Okay. So nigga, and he's like, so I'm like, my nigga. I might feel, and this is exactly what I said, because now I remember it. I said, I'm probably going to feel some type of way about you for the rest of my life, my nigga. I heard that. And and I'm like, and he's like, yo, so what do you, I mean? If you want to do something, with, you know what I mean? When you going to try to do something then? What you want to do? Mm -hmm. And I'm like, my nigga, I di honestly, I did want to do something to you, my nigga. You said if I wanted something. And I said, but if I wanted to do something to you, I'd do something to you. Mm. That's what I said. You said it would have been happened. Or it would have been happened or something like that. Mm -hmm. I was right there. And, and... <laughs> And, and he acting like that's out of pocket to say. I was just surprised because why are you surprised? Because you don't know my handle. No, it's not about you. You surprised that, that a nigga that stole me no, is no, the no, only no. nigga that got away with in his life no, in front no, of the world. No, you surprised I'm Can not friendly? Can I talk? Can I talk? All right, say please? no more. My bad. Please, <clears throat> thank bad. you. I was surprised because I'm like we in total slaughter. He's trying to be peaceful and bridge the gap. But, but you don't got the right on, to wait, be hold peaceful. Hold on, bad. hold on. Let me say that's what I was wrong at then. I can admit I was wrong for automatically assuming that he should, you should have been receptive to it. I just thought that, yo, you know, it's been too much going on. You know better, yo. You know what I'm saying? We, 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 in, we, in, a, we, in, a, we in PlayStation Theater. We in a nice place. Mm -hmm. Big hand, <laughs> hands and all them niggas around Jones. I saw them. I saw them around him. I was right there like, uh, uh, smack. All so right, you know, I it. thought he was about to get his shaking. This Probably you, standing there. I'm like, you, 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 and you that's what happened. That's what happened. I see hands. He's standing around me. So I'm like, yo, what's up, man? And he like, what's up? And then it, he snuck out the cut. Yo, yeah, man. And then Fab <laughs> said, am I lying? I'm fine. You're not lying. Then he, then he snuck out the crazy. cut with the ass. But when you talk, <laughs> I'm thinking we about to get his <laughs> shit again. After, after you said, after, this, is, this rap shit is oh, crazy, man. After you said that line, Matt did, Matt, what, Matt was it? Matt That's still talks shit to that. Like, why you, know, you talking like said, that? Then he said, why you talking like that still? And I said exactly why I said it. You said you repeated. I'm always feeling away. My nigga. My whole life. Let's just agree to disagree. Don't. I'm not taking no pictures. Just leave it at that. 
Mm. He what does that. he do after this? See me in Miami and try to sneak a picture? Mm. Come on, bro. All right. Oh, no, no. All matter of right. fact, we gotta, we gotta, I'm we gotta fucked go up. To my man. I might even be telling the bag. Out of, Miami was Miami before was that. I'm yeah. But not doing that. You're still doing troll shit online, though. You're doing other shit. All right, that's like, on. All right, hold on. Whatever. We yeah. just don't do that. So let's stop. Right, we cool. wasting yeah, enough yeah. energy on that. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Grizzy. Time out, time out, time out. Time out. Tell the man. Yeah, yeah, G. Yeah, yeah. My, my man Grizzy. What's up, my man? So goes pockets looking clean. Nah, we appreciate that. Yo, so you got the project out. I see the album joint. What's up? He like, yo, I, mean, I want to get to. That nigga say, yo, <laughs> this shit is not an art. I want to <laughs> get to him too because it's, 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 yeah. it's getting hotter here. I want that shit to start coming off, man. <laughs> Why he said that? It's a premeditated space like this. He's a legend, boy. He is. He said space like this. Oh, shit. That's what, how you say a legend. You just say some real weird shit. Nigga. Yo. <laughs> Next time, just be like. It's just my way. <laughs> you know what I mean? Some other shit. This shit gonna be lit though. It's gonna be lit. See, shot time. Like, you can nah, time. Get I, fuck, G, yeah, I, fuck, give, I give fuck with it though. I fuck with it. I saw some videos online. I seen, you know, I'm like, yo, I look past all that shit. I just heard the, heard the bars. You, 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 you wouldn't mind rapping too, Buzz. Can we hear something? Yeah, like, I'm right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. be the first one to rap in here. Word. I just want to hear something. Besides TMS. Because, that's, that's yeah, besides TMS. You know why? Because it's hot as fuck in here. I'm that's sorry, what, that's what I'm saying. We got to get my man before it start. You know, I don't know that shit going to be good at the heat and all that. It's surprising. It's still surprising. It's what I'm saying. I heard that, because Because this guy is going to talk his asshole. Because I'm going to get at him. I'm done. You're not done. You're not done. So let's listen. We're going to get everything that ever happened in your life out there. So talk to him. Talk to him. You got the album all right. Hey, slow yourself down. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Don't, don't rush, don't rush us. Don't rush us. <laughs> you got the album out, right? Album yeah, out right yeah, now, yeah, yeah. entitled uh, "America." Right, right. Let's talk about it. I see the, uh, the, the 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 tracks on here. You got a lot of controversial um, titles on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the first thing I saw. Uh, well, folks, the disclaimer, email. disclaimer. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever we read is. Only from Grizzy, views. yeah, not from no. Flip the Script, it's, it's has nothing Grizzy. to do with it, and we do not necessarily agree with his points. Now, so, <laughs> now, I'm going to read some titles. I want you to kind of explain to me what I you, what, what you, you, you know. Nigga, I got sponsors, nigga. You crazy? Like, you know, the first, uh, all right, so the, the first track that caught my mind was uh, Fuck Lady Liberty. Right. Let's talk about that. You dissing the Statue of Liberty, my <laughs> nigga? Talk about that. That shit That's came from sick. France, you know that? <laughs> do you even know your history about the Statue of Liberty? No, I really don't give. Who shits about what? Oh, America that's, has. that's what I had to ask. I saw this here. I'm like, yo, I'm I know he just got. Gonna be honest, but you, all right. So what? what we can where did that come from? That t- title of that song. Yeah. What's that about? Let's talk about. All right. It. So basically, the whole album is basically about my views on America. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? How I feel about everything that's going on, as far as racism. You know, Colin Kaepernick and his his stance, mm-hmm. and basically how they still treat us. So the first track, why not start it off with "Fuck Lady Liberty" and everything it represents, mm. and then I go and well, you'd have to hit a yeah, track. You, you got, but you got. Yo, di- but tell us what it means, yeah, though. Like, like, you, can't, you don't just paraphrase, bro, because the track is not a specifically about Lady Liberty. It 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 that's basically like pretty much like symbolism right there. I'm just saying, fuck Lady Liberty because this is how I feel. You know what I'm saying? And then I go dive into the track. So it's no so the title doesn't reflect the song. <clears throat> the title's not exactly about the song. Like I don't dive into my Lady nigga, Liberty. You are weird, my nigga. <laughs> yo, every tr- <laughs> yo nah you, <laughs> you a funny dude. I had to, I had you ain't to. trying to who you, who you trying really to call me. <laughs> I'm about to call you really do be flipped. I, I, I realize that. That's what he does. No. I'm going to flip for a 311. The track is not directly about. What you talking about? The track is not directly about fucking Lady Liberty. Let me go through a few other tracks. You got to go there. If you want to talk about the Colin Kaepernick song, that song is directly about Colin Kaepernick. That song is directly about it. But fuck Lady Liberty, no, it's not about it. That's just the start it off like, this is how I feel. You don't always right. have to, you know, All right, so let, let's title. get past that. How about this one? Now, look, I'm, I'm going to go towards the end a little bit. This track this, this track is called I Hate Black Niggas. Yeah. Let's talk about that. What's, what's that All about? Right. Point at me, my nigga. Please. Oh, nah, nah. You, you, you hear? No, no, no. <laughs> Flip's a cool nigga. He cool. You like him? He cool, right? Nah, he's a cool nigga. He just be acting funny right now. Oh, he yeah, act funny. funny. Oh, oh it's his job. It's his job. I know, nah, I get it. It's, it's not my job. And it's I, not my and job, I, and I acted man. funny on the phone. Nigga, when I text you, I was it's funny job. too. 
No, I don't. No, I know. He ain't no, acting that funny if you up here. So that's no, that, no, love, no. I know? respect him because he's a stand up nigga. You know? I get, it, but y'all do. My <laughs> I ain't want to give you that, but yeah. but <laughs> I, so it's true. I'm not, I'm I guess not, it's true a little bit. <laughs> Hold on, let, 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 let me explain. Let me explain. Yeah, yeah, so the song time. "I Hate Black Niggas" was basically a play off of Chris Rock's famous comedy sketch oh, that he okay, had. Okay. Well, it was you got black people and you got niggas. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So I basically dove into those topics about. Oh, no, no, no. oh, oh! I basically dove into those topics about how you got some black people who are stand up, you know, mm -hmm. they hard working, and then you got niggas okay, okay. who are just disrespectful, and they kind of they kind of hold back the race as a whole. That's how I personally feel. That's okay, all okay. It was. I see. You know, the, these titles look real controversial. You know what I'm saying? What's another crazy one? Uh, he got a. It's a whole joint. Like he got lost niggas. He got. He got a. <laughs> well, lost niggas was a play off of luck shit. Okay. Bishop warned us. Bishop from Juice or Bishop? Yeah, Bishop from Juice. Mm. Like movies a lot. Huh? Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I'm a so movie. You're not about the I'm bishop, a movie. The bishop, the bishop, the bishop that from the Pope Bishop. That, 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 nah, I'm saying, bishop oh, Don Juan. No, no, no. You're talking about the they, they, they touch a little boy. But well, let me. Oh my God! I just wobbled. Yeah. Let me yeah, take that back. Come on, don't do that yo, to him, man. Let me kill him, yo. B. But yeah, oh, I took that back. That's crazy. Come you see, you're, you're forcing me, man. Talk. Oh, man. I tell you, yo, screw you me. I took that back. You got juice post the right the Catholic Church. I tell you, I'm sorry. How could you not think it's about this? What made me say that? What made me say that? That nigga went to the church. Yo. Yo, nah, you, you got, it should look kind of crazy. Like it just, you know, see, lost niggas. I ain't look at it. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't look at it. I, ain't I don't trust the freedom of speech. Thing. Dead nigga. <laughs> like it's a lot. Of, you know. So, so, so. How many niggas? How many crack crackers? Niggas songs? Oh, a lot of lost niggas, old. lost niggas, dead, dead niggas, 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 uh, fifty niggas, but, but see, <laughs> nigga, you gotta, you gotta, <laughs> you, gotta you gotta, you gotta, <laughs> you gotta understand <laughs> if you, if you reading it, you yeah, got, you, you see, there's a, and then there's the er. Certain songs uh, got er, okay. certain songs got niggas. Let me ask you so a question. So when I'm speaking to, mm -hmm. when I'm certain songs, I'm speaking to niggas, mm. and then when I say nigger, I'm talking about obviously the racism with hanging us. Shit. Hey, I yeah, yeah. It's a, you know. Let me it should sound like he must have some shit to say in this shit. Let me shit. ask you a question. Facts. What's the message you're trying to convey to the world? I mean, there's, there's different messages. I don't just oh, have... Bro, wow. I don't just have one no. message. This nigga message? Me, I, I don't just have one Yo, message. You, about, you see why this... I can't bring niggas up here? Yo. <laughs> this is your Let time to shine. Message you got crazy. Your, this shit gonna get views because he talk... This shit, you gonna get seen because you won't hear with him together. Oh, can we oh, talk yeah. about my album? I mean, we talk about crazy shit. Nah, nah, I'm just saying. We talk about your album. I'm saying you you, 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 you you lucked up, my nigga. So you take up. the time up to shine, my nigga. You don't sway. I respect it. He want to hear some passion. Passionate, like imagine you on, you know, doing your E True Hollywood story. Tell niggas what you want the world to feel. To understand, but bro, and I'm just telling you right now, like, I, I don't, don't have I don't know. one message to convey to people. That, that's that, real. That that's would a be, real that would answer. That would be though. stupid for me to say I have one message to that's convey. That's a real to people. answer. Though. There's so many different things I want to convey to the world. I can't just tell them like, yeah, it's just this. I want to talk to lost niggas, and that's it. There's so much shit I, like I want to, bro. Give me five. All right. <laughs> this guy's a funny guy. I mean, one thing I'm trying to get people to stop with the fucking dick riding shit. Like, you see, obviously, I come up here different, look crazy, but I don't. Well, you said I look crazy. You look crazy. Uh, he's all right. He said I look crazy. Wow, Put the goggles on. He's a very I'm nice. <laughs> 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 he's he's, he's into this doing type doing of stuff. He, he, he might bite off your shit. He might bite your whole swag. Tomorrow he gonna have face paint on. Put the goggles on. They not want to be. What character is that in, in the cartoon with, 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 the, with the goggles on? What, what character, you know, what, what character is that? It's like it's, back it's in the day when you yeah. had the tag it's on the hat. Like it's you're just it's supposed to be there. Yeah. He had a little shit on with, with the goggles. What, what, what he cartoon? was from Secret Squirrel? Is it that? Is it Secret, nigga Secret Squirrel, man? Let me see. Let me see. It might be. Hold on. Hold on. Um, you talking about motherfucking Handyman? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Not Kung Fu. You know what? Me and Secret Squirrel. Oh, no. Blank Man. You talking about Blank Man. <laughs> Blank man, oh, this is crazy. Dude. That's what you said. The nigga with the goggles. Oh, you talking about him? No, 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 hell no. Muttley, uh, 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 look up. Oh, 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 wait, wait. Look up, look up, look up, look up. Uh, it's some shit. Put Muttley, put Muttley, Muttley. I don't know how to spell that. Though. M U T L L Y L E Y. Uh, Muttley crew? What the fuck? Muttley dog. Oh, right. Muttley had the goggles. 
But well, close enough though. He he had the goggles too. Ooh, Ooh you got damn, that's a popular boy. Goggles. That nigga lit. <laughs> Put it on my nigga. Let's see. I'm not Come on, on, bro. This, this is how it. I rock it, bro. Oh, yeah. I'm not doing it. I never feel Mali. victory to peer pressure. That shit don't work on me. Look at first of all, look how I look. That shit don't work on me, bro. All right, let's hear some bars, I mean, man. I want to hear. I want to hear a few bars from from the album. Like, wanna pick, let's pick one of the tracks and let's hear some. Cause I mean, I just spit. You just spit. Yeah. All right. So I said, look. I said, yo, fuck it. I'm going off. I'm Snoop at the Source Awards. This East Coast. Y'all ain't got love for death row? Hands down, that's gotta be one of the best quotes. But now we stuck with MCs that suck dick, the joke's over. I'm more hover than Jay Hover. Watch the throne, go tell Cole to scoot over. Kendrick Cole, but I'm more colder. I'm a cobra. I might hiss at you and tell you to suck my scrotum. I got a chip on my shoulder the size of a fucking boulder. The more verses I spit, the more bolder I get. So bar for bar, I might go harder than Nas. Even God had to say, God damn, that boy hard. I'm so ahead of my time, that time is pissed off. I hop in a booth, I got it looking like Babylon. All these rappers do is just bullshit in Babylon about Beamers, Benzes, and Bentleys. Bitches that party hard. I'm tired of these fans and rappers that keep mumbling. I want to pull a gun. On them. I got no love for them. Click, clack, get back, stop st stuttering. Man, fuck this shit. I'ma go indie. Labels telling me I gotta rap like Nicki, but I don't wanna rap like I got Tourette's. I just wanna rap the life I live. You know, money, hoes, whips, then contradict myself and shit. If Tupac did, I could get away with it, and I love Tupac, so that ain't a diss. But fuck Rick Ross. That shit is. Big fat bitch, I hate that prick. He ain't never sold coke, he ain't never sell crack, and you niggas bump that. What's that? Fuck that. I don't wanna hear that. I wanna hear real rap. RP Pump Big L in stack. Let him fuck me up. I don't give a fuck. Niggas still fat, fat as fuck. I mean, so many rappers is out making a false profit, false profits, cleft low dollars, trying to bribe them. I mean, I could keep going with you. Mm. you know I press the bell when I want you to stop. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> we went from top tier <laughs> rappers to whack MCs. Yeah. Used to have queens from Queens to reign supreme. They left us with the Iggy Azaleas and Little Bs. These motherfuckers be mumbling. Half of these rappers fiends. Too much of that syrup sipping. Aunt Jemima's not too pleased. Mm. I'm like Joe Clark like on a that. rooftop. Like Sam's, don't you smoke crack? And just jump. Don't pump fake. You pump weight. Pulled up an eight when the vans come. I bet the cops won't find no lean on me. Because I don't smoke crack, motherfucker. I sell it but the way the game's looking i might just have to go bear it the coach is looking embarrassed the kids all turn into addicts mm. rappers blaming the parents parents blaming the rappers mm. i'm just sitting back trying to cope with all of this madness like mm. am i a conscious cat or am i just really that backwards one minute i'm marshall mathers next minute i'm machiavelli god damn it thug life across the belly no <laughs> let me ask you a question mm. Do, would you could you elaborate you text me something that you had an issue with, with somebody. Would you would you elaborate on that? Or are you scared to? I'm not scared of nothing, bro. Saying, I told you, you, you I'm a you man said, before anything. You said, and if it happened, then if you ask about it, I'm speaking on it. Uh, you said Troy Ave people got you. You got said two me. people. Can you explain that Troy Ave people situation, please? All right. Well, I mean, back when I did the J. Cole ain't fucking with me video, mm -hmm. I was trying to get promotion for it. I do my own shit. Nobody helps me. So I reached out to Hovane. Oh, wow. Whole veins, fat ass. That nigga, mm. he fucking took all my bread. Troy Ave was right there with them. Right there with them. They all constructed this little shit to get all my bread. And no, but, they, but, did, they did no PR. They did nothing. But hold on, hold on, hold on. What was, what was, you can't, you just jumped. What was Wait, the deal? What, you, what was the deal? How did it, how did it, so you reached out to him yeah, and asked him to do what? What did you want him to do? PR for my video. PR work is getting it out there. Okay. Same way you getting your artists out there. Mm -hmm. If you could do that for me, I will pay you because that's how you do PR. So, so. you you was dead, Troy Evans. Where you, where you at, in the studio? Nah, club? Brooklyn. Right at that 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 place. I don't know that. Right where the Biggie mural, I think, was. Some taco place. Okay, got it. So what happened to you? How much you gave them? I gave them, well, for me, it was a lot. I gave them at least like. Probably like eighteen hundred for me. That's a, a mm, lot. Because no, it is. It I'm is. I'm an independent artist. I do everything myself. I don't have a manager. No street team. No nothing. So Plus, I got bills to words. pay. So what? So, so yeah. So what? 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 What did he? What did he did that? What? What, what did he do? What did he, he just took your money? What he didn't do? Like what? What do you feel away about? He didn't do anything at all. Nothing. She, they just took my money. Nothing. He was like he was on the phone with me. Like yo, I'ma get you your video and get it popping and this and that. Troy Ave, uh, 
Uh, I spoke with Troy Av or whatever. We going to get you a feature and all this too. Boom, and nothing happened. No, ha, ha, they just vanished. And the, and the reason why I'm including Troy Ave in it, because they were both there. So I know they, were, they orchestrated that shit. Either Troy said, yo, just take that nigga's money, or fucking um, Hovain was like, yo, I'm going to take this dude's bread. And that's, that's what happened. So I can't. I could never respect anybody who does shit like that because niggas know how hard it is. I seen him oh, yes, in bitch. person. In per, it wasn't no phone call. I seen these niggas in person. They took my money. How you feel about mm. that space? Do you relate to something like that? I mean, but Hovain's not public relations. He's a manager. Well then, he should have told me I can't do anything with that. With that. With that PR. That that's 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 absolutely. Welcome to the music industry. Do you know? Do you, mm. a nigga's manager because you think? Do you know Jose? You know you know him. I, I've seen him around. I know niggas he fuck with, but I don't like. I'm not. I don't. I don't yeah, I know. I know. I know. Bro, you absolutely right as far as that, but you gotta understand. You absolutely like nigga. Go ahead. Nah, it's true because he's <laughs> yes. absolutely right with that. But I'm 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 young. I'm a young artist, it's naive. Fucked up. It's fucked up. I'm a come. Yeah. I'm I'm only seeing you got, what I'm got before seeing. too. You can relate. You, people did. But I mean, got like. You have. You are young, bro. You, you have. You man. have. No, I'm saying when that. You know <laughs> what I'm saying. When that shit yeah, happened. Yeah, yeah. What I mean, what I mean got, you have invested in certain things when people acted funny before. Do you remember? Like, like when I mean invested, like not like, but people didn't live up to their word, or not even money wise. That's have, happened to everybody. People have yeah. told you stuff and you they yeah. haven't did it. Yeah, yeah. That's how I think, I think everybody can relate to that. And you get you get upset. <laughs> we talk about it. Yeah, I don't want to say. <laughs> I think everybody can relate can to I, that. Can I talk a little bit about my album? The top. Wait, hold on. Yeah, we gonna yeah, finish we gonna up gonna with you. We're gonna wrap up with you. Stop. I mean, it's it's cool, be two man. hours, man. Yeah, so yeah. what? So what? Get tired. So you should have <laughs> never wrote me today, nigga. <laughs> Yo, so so uh, so. And who was the second person? Be careful. We come to the show. Who was the second person that did it? You said two people did two times. You said flip happened twice to me. Oh, the other person was some some radio lady that worked with Cali. I can't remember her exact. How much you pay her? I paid her at least like it was probably like a G. Mm. And what was her to get your your video it, out there? It was, it was PR. Like yeah, like we gonna get it all. To, we're gonna. Why get, you never hit a PR? At the, a, a actual PR? because the firms were charging me thirty five hundred every month. That's a that's a PR yeah, firm. Yeah, the PR is gonna take you to the radio station to here today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They gonna take because they have those connections. Right, right. Not the manager, you going to a radio nigga to get on the radio, like. Yeah, but he he probably uh, he had, had a certain budget he working with. He, he heard spoke to somebody else and they're oh, like, all right, cool, eighteen hundred. All right, whatever. All right, let's, let's just try to make it happen. So. After that, that's like somebody coming up to you and telling you to oh, just, put me on G, uh, find me a, a fucking videographer to shoot my video. You hit me up, I don't give a fuck. I don't know this person. Yeah, but but you know but, if, but if, if, if they know I'm connected, if you hit me up direct, that's a different. Look at his face. But look at that nigga's face. Hold, hold on. But what you think he's talking about, right? <laughs> no. But, but, if, nah, nah, but nah, nah, nah. If, if you if you don't know. Everybody in the industry like that, you know certain people, and you know that G Money connect. All right, I know G Money yeah. does the parties, he does these, the podcast. Maybe he can get my shit popping. So I'll pay him to get my shit going but somewhere. You to give it to another nigga. That don't make yeah. sense. That but don't make but sense. he don't know where it's going. He just know that I, I I'm I'm lit. And give it to me and he pay me whatever. I, I, I'll charge half of what the other nigga's charging. So, and I'm telling you what he told me. I yeah. obviously I didn't just be like, yo, take this money, do whatever you can. I said what. Uh, the things that Troy Ave's getting, the looks on all these blogs, because right. he was popping all over the blogs. I'm like, are you doing that for Troy? Mm. He's like, yes. I'm like, oh, I right. would you be able to possibly do this with this video? And mm. how much do you charge? He was like, yeah, that's the, the that's the type charges. of PR I oh, do. Okay. Well, uh -huh. Let me just say this one thing, man. You know, before because we, we we gonna sign up with you and go and, and wrap it up with June. You know, the the problem of the matter is that. Yeah, you guys are just too nice. What do you mean? That's what it is. You nice. G is nice. You know what I'm saying? You guys, you had, you guys got to, it's just nice guys. Always lose, last, get last. <laughs> it's the truth. It's fucked up. It's you true. Up your mind. Should you be disrespectful? You no, 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 no. That's good. That's good. That's a good one. I'm just saying, no, no, no. G, let, let me use G Money as an example. G, Money's, he, 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 G Money is a guy that will support you. He, G Money, no, no, I'm a funny style nigga. Don't come to me. Facts. <laughs> I'm funny style. I'm gonna get you. 
It's the truth. <laughs> but you know, lately I've been trying because I have a business That's partner. Been doing your books. I, 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 have, I, have, I have a business partner who's a good guy, so I right. can't. It's st- I'm not gonna stain him. Right, right. I have right, another right. business partner that's a good guy. I'm not gonna stain them. Right, right. And he, nigga, he'll tell you, nigga, he put up with a lot of shit from me. But even before that, in, in, in labels and different places, and his stories is crazy. But what I'm trying to say is that a guy like GG would see somebody like, you know what, yo, I give you this to do this for me, da da da. And they may act funny or prolong. Yeah, yeah. And I just feel like, yo, man, you gotta be aggressive with these niggas and be funny sometimes. You, you same thing, you eagerness. You Say eager. Again? You gotta be aggressive you gotta with be the, aggressive with your career. And hold funny. on. Oh, all right. You and gotta funny. be aggressive with your career. Hold, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> all right, cool. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna get back to you. I'm just, I'm just saying, though, and, and you, you just like, yo, you know what? Don't. These, everybody, ain't, everybody ain't good niggas, man. That's how I feel. So you gotta be, you gotta be careful. Cause I, I can tell you've been through a lot. You got you got to be careful. Right, I mean, you got to be care. You got to be right. careful. Like, I'm happy that this played out the way it played out. You know what I'm saying? Cause in your mind, you're like yo, Queens flip and G Money flip the script. Niggas kept their words. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm Played yeah. out. You know what I mean? And, and, and that, I was gonna have a girl up here actually with you, and right. I was gonna make it fun. Right, like, right, you, know, right. you know what I mean? In terms of serious, serious joke. So now it played out properly, and I'm happy it did that. To show that you know that everybody ain't out here to rob you or violate you. Right, right, right. But you gotta, you, my man's in it. You gotta be. You, it's, you need to surround yourself with a nigga like me, or surround yourself with a nigga like for real. You have to be aggressive. You gotta be funny. Niggas can't even get me on the phone. That's why I act like that. With you. That's why I was like that with you on the phone. Cause yeah. a nigga can't even. Like, no, it's a no. <laughs> Niggas just want to get on. No, you're not using me to get on. Nah, I, I put the shit from the mud. That's how I feel. I feel- I got a man out there that's been cutting my hair since I was 16 years old. He'll tell you. From the mud. My nigga from Team Over Deals. How I got met him, I ran down on him and, and, and tried to force him to play my record. <laughs> record? What, you was rapping? Yeah, I had a Team oh, Over Deal and all that shit. Oh, shit. shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Now it's coming out. Uh, like, oh, you know what I'm saying? But, but, but wrap, wrap, wrap it up so we get to Jones we can wrap it up with Jones. Wrap it up. Wrap, wrap, say, anything you want to say to the people? Anything? No, I mean, like, I just appreciate you giving me the platform to come up here and so say what I had to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah put, mean, plug your shit in, bro. Well, I mean, you can find me at Grizzy Hendrix on IG and then Twitter, Grizzy Hendrix, and everything just Grizzy Hendrix. It's when they G- watch this and hear this nigga talk, they go look like, who the fuck is that? <laughs> it's gonna work. It's gonna work. Oh, I already know that. It's gonna yeah, yeah, work. Yeah. I already know that. They That's gonna be lit. Fuck serious Jones. Did that serious Jones man? They gonna be like, yo, I seen that shit when you was with the nigga with the mask. You know? <laughs> <laughs> with the lip, nigga, yeah. 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 <laughs> That's serious Jones out here. Bring, go, go, go. They gonna think serious brought the nigga out here to do a crime. What's up with you, man? I see you got a group. Ain't you in a group? Nigga with a mask. Yeah. I don't know that nigga. Mask off. So, so, so. Yeah, Grizzly, Grizzly. Andrews. Andrews. Album out right now. Album out right now. Album out now, Grizzy. Even Jones didn't want to hear it. That's dope. Where they can find the album at? It's on. Well, I'm only selling physical copies right now, but I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna put it on Bandcamp because Apple Music they denied my shit. Mm. I, 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 I could imagine. Of course, <laughs> that's some controversial shit. Yeah, that's look crazy. I know, I know. That's why. That shit look crazy. So, you, so you're selling physical copies right now? You going yeah, only physical that's copies because I can't cool. get it on Apple. Nothing. Still with them physical but I mean, I, I got an album called Controversy on Apple Music. So, Grizzy right. Hendrix, if you want to check that out. Dope, dope. Cool. Dope. Thank you, Grizzy, for coming up. A round of applause for Grizzy. Appreciate, appreciate it. Back to Serious Jones. So, let's wrap it up on this, on this, on this, on this whole situation with, with, with Max. Yeah. Wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, finish it. Nigga. All right, wrap it up. Nigga. Don't tell me that. Don't talk to me like that, please. Thank you. <laughs> so, you're me. This is what I don't agree with now. Can I tell you what I don't agree with? I, the things you said today, I, re, I respect because seeing a different perspective. I understand. I, I didn't look at it like that. You know what I mean? But I don't agree with that. It's two things that bothers me. I'm pretty sure if you and Math wanted to really fight, it could have happened a long time ago. Meaning that it you could. Happen. No, I mean, if you really. Because you said you felt the way because he stole it. Nobody. I, I feel, I'm pretty sure if you really wanted to. It would happen. Because you, you, you're a guy that. You're not backing out from a challenge. So it's either something. I feel like it's either something you want to, something to progress more. I thought you was leaving it alone. When I spoke to you on the phone that time, you were like, yo, Phil, I was thinking, I, I, I said, yo, man. leaving it alone. But they, every time I got a battle, every time it's something, y'all mm. want to keep this shit going and try so to why paint did you, this why, why, fake picture okay. of this beef like as if this is guy is the tough guy why, of it. All right. So it, it's uh, like, right, my nigga, y'all not going to Let's say you're the tough, but then you being the bully, then. I don't because, care about if you, if you it. If you I don't it. care. Every battle is the only thing that he's got to say to me. 
That's you true. see that. That's you true. got nothing else to say to That's me. That's true. You were supposed to blow up already and somebody sucker punch you. That's all niggas got to say. So if that's the only thing that you got to say, it's not me continue. I don't even rebuttal that shit in battles no more. So why, but, but, but why do you talk but, about angry fans? When I see a nigga still perpetuating and still having slick bars, still trying to, even though you slumming and you barely even get booked and no one likes mm. you and you're washed and karma really did kick your ass way better than I ever could, even still... And you kind of was, you was rubbing it in a little bit. I was kind of laughing. You was like, no, that's bro, my man. I was rubbing it in on him. Fell that. off. Like, let's be real. So but, but, you, but, fell but, you fell off. You fell off. I could even made him. You fall. fell off too. How? At one point, you fell off too. I, 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 I fell back from 2008 to 2012 in battling. I wasn't battling nobody. Mm -hmm. Because but even after, I couldn't it, get no money. After after the math situation, I, it, 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 it was kind of. After the math situation, I, I turned up. No, it went the opposite. After that situation, I got booked. I'm, I got twelve battles now. Wait, after that, did you take like a you, so, took, you, you didn't nah, take no time nigga, off at all? Nah. I did. I did exact opposite. I said I'm about to turn all the way the fuck up. So let me ask you a question. You, my you, record is arguably a lot of people say it's debatable, but mm -hmm. my record is arguably like eleven or twelve and oh since 2012. That's when I came back. I mm -hmm. battled him in 2013. Yeah. Yeah. So now, mm. my, 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 why did you why ago. did you talk about it on the show then? If it, cause when, when because I, but, but it's let me relevant. Say, let me say something. Let me say something. When I spoke to you, I'm just saying on the phone, me and you conversation. Yeah. You like a flip? He said, "Don't put it up, flip." I was thinking the same thing, man. I don't want to have this cool. I I gave y'all each other's numbers. Y'all was supposed to speak on the phone, bro. I don't know what happened. You talking about a nigga that prank calls people and shit? He'll call you from some weird number doing a voice, like some weird shit, my nigga. This so the type why of shit that this guy does. Why do you talk about I don't him? talk to people like that, why, bro. Why? <laughs> I don't know about you. Why do you talk? I have nothing to say don't, to don't, that Don't guy, bring me into and this. And I don't want to talk about it anymore. I, I addressed it because of the fact. Why you didn't talk about it? Why, why, you, why you talked about it on Angry Fan? That's because what I Because niggas is, he asked me questions about it. He's asking me about oh, it. Man. The niggas battling me. He has nothing else to say. That's all niggas got to say to me. Literally. Okay. Three rounds of a nigga sucker punched you five years ago. Like, all right, my nigga. I don't even know how that's respectable because mm -hmm. at first... Honestly, I thought niggas was gonna throw me under the bus way more than they did. Niggas fucked with me and was like, nah, that's some sucker shit. He's a clown. They didn't fuck with him for years. He wouldn't get booked. Nobody fucked with him. Then he got his ass whooped by disaster, which was, you know, disaster actually told me he was gonna do it. And I didn't believe him, honestly. I didn't think he was built like that. And when he said, yo, I'm gonna fuck this nigga, we gonna fuck this nigga up for you cuz the West Coast don't respect it and all that. I, I just was like, all right, bro, you know, I just said, don't do it during the battle. I like don't do that during the battle. I don't want you to, you know what I mean? Mm. Even though whatever. And then I battled him and he got mad and was poking me and some shit cause I was killing him. And now it's like people think that's beef. Nigga, I've known that nigga for 10 years. That nigga was the best. I can show you a thousand text messages for it. You know what I'm saying? Like people don't look at this part in battle rap. All they see is what happened on the camera. And if you not a talky ass nigga, like people try to act like I be, I don't be doing blogs about people. I don't do interviews while I'm talking about other guys. It's the longest I've ever spoken about another man in my life. <laughs> and it's only because you want you just had the man and you wanna people wanna know what's the real truth. I didn't want to know nothing, man. I, you, when you when you wrote me, don't, don't lie, don't I lie. I said people don't lie. So this is why he's don't funny. Lie on me. Don't I just lie said me. people. I didn't even say Please him. don't lie on me. That? I said people want to say. Joan, you. I, I said Joe, I don't I don't want to I told her I don't want to talk about it, Joan. I don't want to talk. He's like flip. And I fuck Stop. with you. Stop your reverse psychology. I have it here. Bullshit, I have it here. Nigga. I have it here. But first of all, I said I have it here, said, my nigga. I don't even want to be talking about that. I said I got a bunch of other shit going on. That's what I said. I have it here, Joe. You said if you're hitting me up to talk about that, and I said my nigga, I, I don't, don't want to talk, talk about, about that. I said I said you should have been had me on your show. And what you talking about the whole time I'm up here? Nah, because you, you, you no, you, you, <laughs> you're lying. You told me on the phone you wanted, you wanted. To, you, 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 don't lie. What I say? What I say? Say what I said. You said I want to correct. You said smoke. Never. All right. So you said you I want to stop lying, my nigga. What I say? Because I'm, I'm not into no beef shop. I'm on a different wave, about, my nigga. Oh, flavor. You, I call him flavor. <laughs> flavor, flavor. Flavor, flavor. You said your flip. You said your flip. I don't want. You said I don't want to talk about it, but I want to correct what he said because he yeah, was lying. Yeah, I just said I want to tell the story. So that's I, that's, that's what that's I did. I told the story. That was that was an hour ago. I've been told the story. I had to cut you. I had to give my man some shot time. Nah, we good. All I'm just saying that's the wrap up. The wrap up. Let me wrap it up in one sentence. Groupie guy that I didn't like. Would you didn't battle him again with, if somebody paid you? 
Groupie guy didn't want to deal with, got yeah. obsessive and weird, borderline homo, curved him. You're, mm. you're mad that, and now I'm cocky. You got an obsession with me and you want to get even with me. Didn't know that. Battled you because it was a bag. You got off. Fine. I'm going to catch you when I can do and deal with you the way I deal with you. We, the people like this, they use this to keep trying to make a relevancy out of corny, crabby shit. Mm. I've never done that. I've never been that type of guy. And when people keep coming at me with it, I'm going to just say what's real, my nigga. And if I get in a situation where would I battle him? No. Would I bet. fight him? Yeah. Hmm. We could fight, but we can't battle. So you would never I'm battle. I'm not to rap to you about. You would never battle. If somebody give you a bag. He's not even nice, my nigga. It's not even a thing. Y'all making hmm. this nigga way more relevant because of me. Again, another nigga shine off so my you never, name. So this you is be, what niggas so, try so, to so, do, and you letting them do it. Who, me? Instead of just let me shine. I'm the guy that mm -hmm. niggas is trying to beef with. Let me talk about what I'm doing. Fuck these niggas. Man. About the album. Talk about the album. Well, yeah, oh, let's talk about what I'm doing. Whoa, 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 whoa. I know beef is so. Cool, if they, if they, no, 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 no. Why you, why, 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 why you keep saying that? Like, yeah, what? Shit controversy me. sells, bro. Whatever. You think niggas need to talk about you fighting math? Hopper, I don't want to talk about sell a show. You know why a show was that before you came on here, nigga? That's nah, not. That's rude, my nigga. Well, let's you, stop you, talking you, about no, it. No, no, no. Thank you. I have a last because no, because you talking crazy, nigga. It's not crazy. This your man. He came up here telling. Cool. Yeah, I, he is my man. All right, and he's he a cool. clown. He's a clown. Uh, that's cool. What's right. your opinion? All right. But let me say something. So if somebody pay you to fight him, would you fight him? That's Hell yeah. That's the last. That's the last question. Yeah. So you get so, paid to fight him. If you yeah, fight him for fight. free. Let's fight. He'll fight him for free, let's probably. Set up, let's set, up, <laughs> let's set up a fight where neither one could go to jail. You <laughs> know what I'm saying? And, and we can make some money. I'll right. do that. So I don't want to I don't want to talk about this, man. I don't All right, wanna, let's let it go. I, I, mean? I, I, I just, wanna, I just right. want I just want niggas to know like and niggas never played me pussy, my nigga. All these stories niggas are saying is just fake shit for rap. If niggas want to believe it, go ahead, my niggas. Got it. All right, the album. Let's talk about that and we wrap up the show. Serious Business 3 is available now. Um it's on uh, iTunes. I got a bunch of different projects, actually, that I put out over the years. If you're not familiar with, go to SeriousJones.net. You know what I mean? It's my website. Follow me, please. I need way more followers. I got a whole bunch of views. But I stopped, honestly, at a certain point when you said I fell back. I did. I was living in Vegas. I was getting money. And I got tired of being a struggling, being a famous rapper. You being a pimp rapper. or something? Hmm. <laughs> he said you was being a pimp or something. You was a pimp, right? <laughs> Yeah, look, 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 look at it. Oh, damn, nigga, cool, man. I told you. I knew he was cool, man. Put it this way. Put it this way. I have a real life that I've been scared to talk about for a long time, but now that's, you know, I'm actually living a more cleaner existence where I ain't got to worry about no indictments or statutes of limitations. Now I could talk about, you know, my pimp life and my jail cases and all of the type of things that I've actually been going through, and this is the type of stuff on my album. So if you're not familiar with Sirius Jones music or Sirius Jones life, let's, you know what I'm saying, catch up. You know what I mean? Follow me. Tell us what happened with, uh, two more questions before we wrap it up. Okay. I want to ask you about how you feel about bloggers. Okay. Right? And I want to ask you about, what happened with DTP? What's the real story that happened about that situation? Well, honestly, what, How did you get with, signed? what happened with DTP, I had a, a bunch of people coming at me at that time because really, the thing with me, it's an energy thing with me, yo. And like, when they first saw me on MTV, it was like, that was my first chance, like with the gym battle and shit. It wasn't so much that I killed him in the battle. It was just like, they got to see my energy. They got to see the way I talk, the way I, you know what I mean? The way I think. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what drew people in or whatever. But um, I kind of, you know, that's 80 million homes for almost a year mm. on Fight Club. Mm -hmm. So there was literally millions and millions and millions of people that knew about me and was like, so what's up with you now? Which it still is by the grace of God. But if somebody's not stepping in and saying, all right, cool, new joint, Ludacris featuring Sirius Jones. You know what? You in this new video right here. Summer Jam. Supposed to bring me out and do a commercial on the screen. Never had. Like, it's a bunch of stuff that's just one, two, three shit. Yeah. You're the guy. Say I'm your friend. That's it. I'm on. Did he sign? Did you sign paperwork with him? Just... Yeah, of course. I had a, I had a, um... And I never spoke about, I, I probably have, but actually, no, nah, I'll say it. But um, I had a, like a $5 million deal with them. I had a deal where I got um, I got a nice advance up front of six figures. And then each album went up from 500 up. So first album, 500. Second album, 750. Third album, you know, I think I had like a five or six album deal. So I had everything in place where it looked like, you know, this is what I need to take my career to the next level. But honestly, after that situation, if anybody, label, whoever was watching this, like, I didn't even take a meeting after that. Because when I saw what really could happen to you, 
it was like honestly it you know it was a blessing because of the money it got me you know out of the streets at the time but it puts you in a position now where people are expecting you to deliver something that you can't deliver without the support of your team you know what i'm saying there's no way i could just you know be on as the guy when i gotta go through this system i gotta go through this label i gotta go through these people that they gotta push the button on your project you know what i'm saying so they just never push the button and honestly i had other issues that might have uh deterred people I, I had old people trying to pop up like they wanted something and different shit like that but it was i never got that real stamp i never got like yo hey i'm glue the guys and I just signed Sirius Jones, and he's about to be the next guy out of Jersey. Like, right. I never got so that. So how did everybody know you were signed to them then? I mean, it's a press release, but I'm talking about, like, you personally, like, you know what I mean, putting your name and your thing, your thing on the line, saying, like what Ross does for niggas. Mm -hmm. He's talking yeah. about Ross. Ross jumps out there for his artists and says, yo, this is, he tweets it. He says this. He says he jumps on the project. He gives, you know what I mean? I heard he gave Meek all the regular before he signed to him. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Just, I fuck with you. I want you to win. But I mean, I don't know why that's so hard to find in this game. I don't know why people don't want people to win that actually are talented. But from now on, for me, I mean, I'm not really searching for anything but fans, man. And if, if people that, that's not true. I want to I wanna build my team, but I'm not looking for it like, yo, you be my manager, you, you right, know what right. I'm saying? I'm really just building. And if I could get the right people that finally believe in my movie, my story. Um, also, I got a documentary that's, we got all this shit in, you know what I mean? I've been filming the battles from London to Jamaica to Toronto. Hmm. I got all kinds of real life shit. I'm gonna have people that really could just tell you my story, so I ain't gotta say it, you know what I'm saying? And people could really see what's behind the music and why I'm still here doing it. So. How, how do you feel about battle rap blogging? I think it's getting out of control, honestly. Okay. I think it's getting to the point where, all right, we're in an opinionated society. You know what I'm saying? Everybody wants to live their own show. Everyone's a star, their own reality show. And everybody got a channel to go on every day and say how they feel, you know, what they think. Everyone's a mm -hmm. reporter now. Mm -hmm. So with battle rap, it's even worse because you got a bunch of people that some of them don't understand battle rap. They don't even know how to really judge a battle. They just look at what a crowd says or, you know what I mean? They don't understand the dynamics to how to judge a battle. Just like if you say boxing. You know how you're watching a boxing match and you see niggas swinging hard and some people going, ooh, and none of that shit's connected? You know, in Money, money May or somebody like this, mm -hmm. none of your shit connected, but it just looks hard when he's swinging. Right. And people are like, oh, oh, like, my nigga, that's none of that shit in his face. It's in his glove, it's not connecting. It's a lot of people that do that. You got bars that it might be cool, but it's not really hitting home. You know what I mean? You set something cool, but you got like people that would be like, they just, that's their favorite guy. It's like wrestling. So you're just gonna say he wins every battle. Like, shout out to the Clips, you know what I'm saying? When I battle Clips, you know, that was like the guy. I thought you to took I, th I, th I thought you took that. Exactly. But there's a lot of people that he was pressed, like, he pressed no, me on man, that. I thought they, you took trying that. To, they still don't <laughs> want to say he lost just because that's your guy. Yeah. Instead no. of just being real. And that's what can I you call like it a, can you call can you era. can you call it a draw though? No. I could call it a uh, I could call it a, a debatable. Debatable. Okay. I can't call it a draw though. Cuz 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 press me about that a long time ago on the blog. You said I lost a series. You Jones. did, nigga. You spent the whole first round talking about something that I cut down in one bar. Your whole first round about barber shit. And I did one line and it shook the whole building and it was over for that whole verse. Hmm. But the guess what room I'm in shit was hot. But other than that, he was barbering the whole first verse. You know what I'm saying? That's what I say. Yeah. I said, uh, I said, uh, <laughs> I ain't even, that shit just be coming to me. I just knew that was what I need to say. But I, I don't remember coming up with this shit. But I said, I'm a barber. Oh, uh, yeah, I was a barber eight years ago. So, yeah, I know how to handle clips. And it was like, mm, nah, I nigga, all that barber shit's dead. Because I wasn't a barber. But niggas don't know what I do. They don't know about my life. You know what I'm saying? They don't know. So when you say that, it's like, you, oh, that's what he's doing. <laughs> they don't know at the time I'm in a house. No, nigga, at the time I had a fucking two the bins, a range, a, a crib in Vegas, and a bunch of hoes. So when did you turn to barber? When were you a barber? I was a barber from the time I was 17 to about 2003. Got it. And um, I've off and on been a barber, you know what I'm saying? But I wasn't really in a shop, you know what I'm saying? But 
that's another trade right. I told you. you know, I got, last question. Who, 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 I mean, who are the bloggers you respect? You like Jay Black? Honestly, I did, but I find him entertaining. I find him entertaining, but his opinion on a lot of my belt, I feel like a lot of these people didn't grow up on me. Like they knew Nothing niggas. So they feel like mm -hmm. a lot of them be having bias with me. Like they don't want to just give it up. They're like, I don't know. It's something about Jones. And they be saying this type of shit instead of just being like, yo, he just, he how do you feel about all these battles. How do you feel about his show Champion? I never seen it. Okay. Angry Fan, how you feel about him? Angry Fan, um, honestly, he's a, he's a cool platform for the culture because it creates interesting conversation. Okay. But I think he plays devil's advocate a lot too because, mm -hmm. and he gives it up because he says afterwards, you know what I'm saying? He, he, yo, such such a kill you. Such such a kill you. But then he'll say, nobody beat you really. Hmm. So how's somebody going to kill you? Like every battle, somebody going to kill me. But nobody killed me. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I respect it. I still do interviews on his joint like the last one I did. You know what I'm saying? And um, but I do it really for the culture because that's the culture's tuned in. You know what I'm saying? Paper boy. Uh, I fuck with him because he fucks with me, but I don't really, I don't really watch his shit unless honest. No disrespect to him, but I don't honestly be watching bloggers and shit do unless you, they talking about me or you battle know, I'm in. You know a guy named Battle Truth? The nigga that look like uh, somebody homeless uncle and shit. <laughs> yeah, watch it. That nigga's crazy. Wow, 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 wow. Like like nice. Why does he hate me? I don't know why he hates me so bad either. That nigga be going in for no reason. He not funny to you at all, so you don't laugh, yo? Yo, I, it looks scary to me. It looks like, yo, what's wrong with this nigga? Like, every one I see, he's like, yeah. he's sitting there like, yeah, so with his hair all cut. I'm like, this nigga crazy, my nigga. <laughs> That's all I see when I see him. All right, cool. Right. Chris Unbias, last one. He's gay, man. <laughs> he's gay. He's and no disrespect to him. I like D-Rec. D-Rec is my nigga. Shout out D-Rec. He's fair. He keeps it honest. You know what I'm saying? Um, I like Jims as a blogger. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He's oh, funny yeah. to me. Jims is a He's blogger. one of the best bloggers to me, honestly. Yeah, Jims Even is though, dope. You know, he didn't want to publicly apologize for that weird shit he was doing, but it's all love. I still fuck with you, nigga. And Jims you know is dope. Saying? I like Jims. Yeah, but, um, you know, um, but in general, man, the culture to me is like, I, I'm really a fan of the bars. I'm really a fan of niggas that really are MCs, man. You know, battle rap is just one dimension. Anybody knows I make music. If you don't know about my music, you really, no, no funny, cocky shit, you really missing out. Because I really make dope music. It was my bad that I stopped for a long time because, you know, it's a momentum game. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people in the culture really felt like you left us. People say that. There's a lot of niggas now that really be rooting for other people to beat me just because they feel like, well, you left us. So we had the Arsenals and the Hollows and the, the Tay Rocks and the Two Surfs and the, all, shil the Shotgun Shills and all these other niggas that came in that era from 2008, nine to, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Now, mm -hmm. I was getting money, sorry. I didn't mean to act cocky or whatever. I just didn't feel like I could make more, enough money for me to keep putting my name on the line at that time. They wasn't giving niggas $10,000 bags. You know what I mean? If I'm getting a band every night from whatever I'm doing, you know what I mean? Why I'm gonna spend all this energy to write bars to make 2,500 from a battle? Like I wasn't doing that. But now the culture got up and it got to the point now where you can get paid 10 racks, 15 racks for a battle, you know? Well, we're gonna end with that. Yeah. So, appreciate y'all having me, man. <laughs> Sirius Jones, at Sirius Jones, no O is Sirius. SiriusJones.net, follow me, man, you know? Apologies, we had to spend a whole bunch of time on things that need to be rectified. But niggas need to know my handle. Don't ever try to slam the mm. phones. Talk Don't to do that. Him. That shit solidified. <laughs> niggas say it's crazy. Nah, for real though. Oh man. Calm down. These niggas is cool, man. I fuck with both of them. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, that nigga crazy. Hey. Those niggas, those he cool too. He from Queens, man. He cool. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I got you sound Oh man. You don't want to hear no bars? You don't want his bars? You don't want to hear my bars? Oh shit. But I mean, you know. <laughs> no, I'm just. Yeah, Joe, you want to rap gas? Your bars are um, expensive. I don't got enough. You know, I got to go to the I bank like first, that. man. I like that. See, I like that. You, you know what I'm like, saying? We ain't got Joe. Yeah, Joe. I'll say a little something just off this new shit so y'all can know what I'm working with. All right, let's go. Call your honor. I just got a case of Smith's too. God is good. <laughs> uh, but I was writing that shit for this judge, right? Because they be playing. I said, so your honor. Are you really honorable? 
Because lately seem like y'all really honoring Bull. You know they make us a target. You sit up there and just watch us. Become the modern day farmers. They picking niggas. It's harvest. I'm conscious. How mm. don't you get nauseous? Do you got sons? Wait, how many daughters? So how I feel to be the reason babies missing their fathers? Trying to make America great and stop trumping up charges. Yes, Lord, we all fighting the battle. It's just paperwork to you. My life to you is a hassle. Be in the field, don't even have a ball and get tackled. The law will lineback you. It's like a sack to get you behind the wall and iron shackles with paws. Hit that gavel. Cause I don't want that court lawyer. You judge, but the same way you restore order is banging the hammer. Holding my face, just mm. taking a slander. Watching them paint me like some wankster with savage manners. But if I had a chairs, bruh, then we could kick it all authentic. Let my lawyer sit without the court gimmicks and I tell y'all exactly what I did and I didn't. Because I done copped out the shit that I really committed. For instance, 19, New Year's Eve. Got caught with the steal. Lawyer said he's going to college. Judge said no, he's going to jail. Verbatim. Did a city bid. It wasn't worth stating. Seeds get lost in the Big Apple. Or the worm ate him. Know what mm. the island teach you? It's not just violent people. He sold the food his wife cooked. And that's somehow illegal. They try to slay a skinny little nigga for an ounce of diesel. Now tell me that ain't evil. Cells crowded, fecal metal, smells foul with jail towel. It's a thousand people, every house is loud. They feed you purple chicken, brown seafood. Then you gotta get strip searched by some coward weasel that never been a boss in real life. So you be proud to see you suffering. Your family in the, yo. Mm. Listen, listen, man. <laughs> That's coming out, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 I'm yeah, 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 yeah. I'm talking life shit though, man. Real shit, man. Fuck with me. Life is serious to move. Oh, he be hyping too much niggas. Nah, these niggas is cool, man. man. You know what I'm cool, saying? Right? Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He want me to be cool. He trying to be the coolest be cool. nigga on the show. That's yeah, all. you know what I'm like, saying? He like, fuck out of here. He ain't cool out of here, man. man. It's the flip <laughs> show. That's all right. He about to battle anyway. I'm about to kill this nigga. Oh! Let's go. We signing out, man. I'm going to sleep, man. I'm about to go home and take a nap. You know what I'm saying? Nigga but yo, for three hours. It's the that's a fact. Show ever. Listen, man, two dollars Tuesday every Tuesday night at the Dark Lounge, two two four Merrick Boulevard, Laurelton. You heard me now. You know what I'm saying pull up two dollars Tuesdays every Thursday. Take off Thursdays. New spot. Shout out to the runway. We in the city. You know what I'm saying second ad between thirty third, thirty fourth Street. Pull up. Um, new single out right now. Baggy, mm. moving crazy. You know what I'm saying flip through the crazy video the other day. Shout out to Princess one time. Millie Rock sturdy. Crazy. How long you uh, wait for that video? You thought I was gonna do it, did you? you I, was, I, was you I was, I was, you know. You thought I was gonna you do it, did you? Suit on, you put the yeah, 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 yeah. You thought yeah. I was gonna do it, did you? Did I, you? I was waiting to see if, 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 if you was my right? man. So I was waiting oh, to see. I'm tripping too. I'm not to cut your wisdom. Booming a single. It's out. Videos out. Yeah, yeah. You fucking serious, bro. <laughs> Sorry. My yo, bad. Sorry. Yo, oh, God. He look. He wanna go, but he still want to promote more shit. <laughs> he ain't gonna like go nowhere. Y'all got me talking about other shit. All right, all right, all right, all right, my nigga. <laughs> you thought I was gonna do it, didn't you? I, I was waiting to see. I, I was waiting to see if he was a real nigga. I saw you wrote a, uh, something on Snapchat. You want niggas to be honest with you and tell you they like the record or not, right? That that was inspirational too. All right. That, that wasn't towards you, though. Nah, I, oh. I know that. Oh, I'm just saying. Record. Is your record? Yeah, yeah. I know it wouldn't be Rapping? towards me, man. Yeah, yeah. You know, I just you know, said, like, okay. when, I, 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 I remember. Produce the record, too, also, you know what I'm saying? Yo. yo. All right. What up, though? Chill out, nice. my nigga. I can't, I can't know if he's a producer, man. I related to that. You're an that was dope. I like that. Okay. <laughs> like, you finally, you finally, you know what I'm saying, put your foot down. What? Well, for real? It took you a long time, but you know. My feet always are down, you know what I'm saying? You hear me? Oh, Lord. Yeah, yeah. Ten toes <laughs> down. I'm sorry. I'm out of here, nigga. Oh, yeah, October tired. 21st, Toronto. Are man, you? Sharon. Yo, what the hell, my nigga? <laughs> yeah, we battling. October 21st in Toronto, man. Yeah. Toronto. Hey, yo, we don't want to hear all that all old right, shit. All right, man. Either. Yeah, let's go. It was quick. You are real TV. TV. I'm from Queens. Um, Thank you for sit to Sirius Jones. Thank, thank, thank you to motherfucking Grizzly Hendrix. Facts. Shout out to Space Ghost. You know, they got to definitely do the behind the scenes because I'm taking up all the time. You know, behind the scenes will be 60 seconds. Nigga. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's for your channel. I don't have nothing to do with that. Um, <laughs> and Patreon, too. Um, remember, lock your doors, close your windows, get your binoculars out. And if you see a nigga like Sirius Jones on your lawn, or a nigga like Grizzly Hendrix, get some money. Or a nigga like Grizzly, Grizzly, Grizzly Hendrix, please <laughs> prepare yourself and hold your firearms in your hands because when they come in your house, it may be an issue. Don't be afraid <laughs> to use it. I'm from Queens. I don't know what you're talking about. Come on.